Llego luego. Hey, what, we're in, what the hell? Sako's here? Where are we? What's... Wait, this... This is Brazil? What are you guys talking about? Cream a cat? What? Go for perfection. Buddy, if you touch my stones, you'll get burned. Okay, can I leave? Oh, I can just walk right through them. Wait, is that the, the Mirage girl? Cotton candy. I hate cotton candy. Oh my god, this game is literally a village simulator. Nigger, what happened? Should I get out of here? Damn, these guys... Everyone's selling me candy and shit. I can't go in any of the buildings. No, I'm stuck! Vesper dodging the castle of Fruit Stand. Hey! They removed this statue in the Brazil stage in Street Fighter V. They replaced it with a... What was it? A soccer ball? Oh no! Oh no! We got enough problems. Oh. This is supposed to be a kid's game! Oh.
When did this game turn into a dating simulator? Samba. Dude, I love that game. That Dreamcast game with the maracas. Samba de Amigo? Oh my god. That game is so sick. When I first played that game, I was so hooked. I loved it. I loved it. The Mermaid Tower came out. It's such a great game. <laughs> I'm broke. Oh no, you only like soccer. Wait, shouldn't it be called football? What? Yeah, there's the soccer ball. I would love to play some of the Amigo on the stream, but unfortunately, I get DMC ate up the ass. Dude, I would love to play DDR and those kind of games on on the stream, but you can't. Those are like DMCA central games. Mute the game? That's the most ridiculous idea ever. That's a terrible idea. Your lucky item is a bulb. Alright, Roy. Yep, two more days, bro. Two more days. I'll see you Monday night for the action. Hey, here's a serum. We should buy this. Posh suit. Oh no, something tells me you have to buy this. It sucks too. I'm buying the serum. Add this up. Well, we got money from those chests, right? Okay, you said sleep at the end, correct? Village Simulator. What the hell? I'm lonely so you can stay if you want? Holy shit, they're gonna go out of business. Wait, what? I can't sleep. No, I, I gotta go back to the, the soccer statue. Oh god, no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Better not be a mirage. It's gotta be a mirage.
Oh, shit. Sorry. I knew it. I knew it! Oh, no! <laughs> Uh-oh. Monka S. Oh, no. I hate you! Oh, God. She has a built-in lie detector. Go to the harbor. Hold on, before I even ended up here, yeah, you, you said to go somewhere else. Where the hell am I? If we don't do something, we can't survive. Man, Ark is really multitasking here. Yeah, you said... I don't know. Yeah, you said... Here, scroll up on the chat. You said something to me before I entered the village. You're like, now go up to something. Brazil or some shit. This guy just randomly asks me. What a bunch of wimps. going? What is going on with this game? Oh my god, we finally get to do a dungeon? We finally get to play the game. Guys. Look, we're playing something. Wait, what? A sunken temple. What the hell is the point of this? Yes, money. Level up. Blowing bubbles at me? Holy cow.
Guys. What happened? Only hit the blue fish? What is going on? <laughs> Guys, this game, man. It took a dark turn. It really did. Do I just leave? Oh, what the hell? Her name is Mermaid. Okay. Thanks, Mermaid. Hey, Nana. this guy even is engagement ring so this that was the whole dungeon I just had to kill hit that blue fish twice and that was it Could have been engaged, but that girl had a lie detector and I got screwed. Plus 12? But then I didn't buy any equipment. Another pin? We never use any of these pins, man. I'll give you a boat. I can now row boats to sea? Oh no. I got a boat. You know, you get a boat in Final Fantasy 1 really soon. I was like, wow, you sure showed us. Go to news. I don't even know where the hell I am yet. Why why are you describing these locations with real life maps? I don't even know where the hell I am. First I was in Brazil, now I don't know where the fuck I am. And even if I did know where I was, I, I don't even know where the fuck New Zealand is. Aren't they on an island? Isn't that by, like, Australia or something? <laughs> I don't fucking know. Okay, are you sure I'm not missing anything in this area? Because you sent me on a wild goose chase. Ever since I 
I saw that bird. Yeah, I got the boat. Holy cow! Is that... Wait, where's Australia? Come on. I know Australia is right by Japan. Come on, I think this is Australia right here. This map looks different though. Shouldn't North America be on the left side of the map? Hey look, I found it. Yeah, New Zealand. They have no dock though. Wait, yes they do. How are you supposed to figure that out? There's no indication, no landmark. You know what? I came here just for one rock. You gotta be kidding me. Guys. This is one of the worst, like, side quest games I've ever played. Even if it was like a thousand gems, I'd be more hyped. The side quests aren't for the reward, it's- What the hell did I learn from doing that, Qua? What lore? The only thing I found out is the location of New Zealand. You learned that New Zealand is on Earth. Yes. There is a small island between Australia and South America. Uh... Australia, South America. You gotta find it. Okay, between Australia and South America. What's this? Oh wait, there's a hole here too. Well, at least I'm learning my geography, guys. Sick. Hey, there's treasure here. Remember when this game had dungeons? And combat? Oh no! The emulator. Inbu Pike? Enbu Pike? What does that stand for? Holy cow! Plus seven? Does that heal me? That doesn't seem to. It has the same color as like the original spear. Yeah, exactly. If only I can use this weapon in dungeons. Do I have a teleporter ring? What the hell is that? What's a teleporter ring? I'll be right back. While you figure out where I have to go.
How do I check the box? No, I don't. Okay, where the hell am I going? Oh my god. Remember Australia? <laughs> yeah, I remember Australia. <laughs> remember Australia? Uh huh. There's a what above it? What the hell are you talking about? Here? Oh, this is Japan, you're right. A lot of islands together. Yeah, hey, could you speak English, please? Okay, which dock do I go to? The one on the top left. Okay. I guess it's this one? No, bottom left. There's like all these like little areas with like magic rocks. Whoa! We need armor though. Fuck. We need like a crazy hidden like armor. Oh, I forgot to use this potion. Go here? shoes I wonder what these do it's an armor no what is this it's a relic oh it's right here yeah Run like the wind. Nice. How, how much faster are we? We're like the same speed. Roughly 5% faster. What the hell? The lore.
Young Ko. Am I in Japan? What the hell? I'm in China? Oh, I can go up. Wow, look at all the lights! Wait! They already discovered electricity? That's insane. Hey, this guy just came in the chat and he's... ...saying random letters. That's crazy. He lost his mind? He probably played too much KOF. It's not open. What the hell? I have to stay at the inn? What's with this game and using the inn? You rest good, important for a long life. Oh my god, look, there's Bugs Claw! She looks like Chun Li. Are these the item shops? No, it's the fortune teller lady. She's everywhere. Do I still need a bulb? Running fast brings luck, but new shoes are needed. I already have the shoes. Oops. Oh my god, I have so many Magi Rocks. 47. And I don't even use them. Dragon Spear Kung Fu. Doggy? What? There's a serum here. Hot water? Should I buy this? Oh, Kung Fu Gi. Holy water? No, it's hot water. Should I buy this? Probably, it's only 90 bucks. I not come shop. Where is long trading? It beside drugstore. Okay. It's a Japanese martial arts uniform. Like a gi? Hey look guys, this says Enix. That's crazy. Hey look, Magiro.
Hmm. Oh no. Oh no. Castle sounds like a dungeon. Speed shoes let you run like the wind and charge into things. Oh no. So it doesn't even make me run faster. They're called speed shoes. It's literally for like beating a dungeon. I don't want your fruit. Hot rice? You not like rice broth? That is sad. <laughs> Listen, asshole. Village simulator. Okay, where the hell am I going? Hey, here's the castle. Oh my god, it looks just like that other castle. Do I want to go here? Fuck! Jaeger won't let me play! Go to go to Canada? Uh I know where that is. It's up here. Hey, there's an island here. Who's this? The ultimate luxury is relaxing where nothing can disturb you. Who are you? You want to catch a nap? Wait, I'm not even sleeping on anything. Wait, oh, I'm sunburnt. Macho appeal up by 10. Nice. What the hell is the point of this area? Okay, I see Canada. How do I enter? Okay, we're in Alaska. Getting dangerously close to Alberta. It's a banger! It's a banger! It's a Haruki! Hey, Balthazar, thanks for the five bones. Okay, what is going on? What is this crazy question? How poor, poor form is it to bring a loaf of sliced bread, peanut butter, and jelly to an ultimate Marvel 3 torrent, pull them out where your opponent gets a TAC infant, and start making a sandwich? Well, that's one way to gain a sponsorship. I like peanut butter and jelly. Only two more days till cage buffs? How you know cage is getting buffed? Nice. 
Remember when Nash got his three framer and the Nash players were jumping up with joy? And they didn't realize what it cost. Yeah, those those uh, Marvel's recalls are ridiculous. I remember there was that one with Dante during the stream, and then uh, it was like yipes of them, and they were playing ads during the infinite. It was super funny. Oops. If they nerf Cage, I uninstall. Kinda wanna play Mika if she gets her invisible wall back. That'd be fun. I can go back to freedom. And they've been hyping up this patch for a while, so it better be good. They will nerf low tiers and buff top tiers? That's what they did with the V-Trigger scaling patch. Hope you enjoyed the geography lessons. Yeah, it was cool finding out where New Zealand was. I could have gone to the north side. No way. Wait, why is there a cutscene? Like I just said the same thing. What the hell's going on? Daigo once again reigns supreme. Daigo's on a big win streak right now. I think the other pro players are just bored and kind of gave up. The town north of freedom. Hey, the guy making the cheeseburgers? I finally get to go to the cave? Oh, no. Kawano's carried by Colleen. <laughs> LZ, that's such an insult, bro. Kawano is so godlike, bro. <laughs> He's so godlike, dude. Oh yeah, we gotta tell this guy about the mermaid. I can't wait, uh, bro, sorry to tell you. So I gotta give him the engagement ring? Uh-oh. Oh no. Man, we just give everyone bad news with these side quests. Wait, why did he disappear like a ghost? What the hell is going on?
Remember when Fujimoro's got like and then Ibuki got nerfed? Carried by a character that never remembered again? Okay. You bring up an interesting point, LCD, but... The problem with Fujimura is that he fucking uses Chun-Li instead of using... I think Ibuki got nerfed, but I still think he would do better with Ibuki because he downplays that character so hard. And don't forget, Fujimura is actually doing better now because he switched to Kami. But he doesn't love his character. He's not, got no loyalty. I swear he would do a million times better with Ibuki. I, I hope with these Ibuki buffs he actually takes a look at the character again. That guy downplays Ibuki so hard. I mean, Colleen's really good, but, like, man, it... There's a ton of matchups I think she loses. If it wasn't for her insane V-trigger. Air Herb? I could dive underwater now? Is this, is this a snorkel? That's the last item. For breathing underwater, it is a snorkel. So I guess I go to where those bubbles are. We haven't seen what, the, what these damn air shoes do yet. I feel like this game is giving me... I guess, I don't know, because we're doing all the side quests and stuff. I just feel like the pacing of getting all these items is kind of like all at once. It's weird. Yeah, the only person I know that still plays Ibuki is like, Shine. That's it. The thing is, Jaeger, if you haven't helped me with this game, I would probably would have flushed it. Like, there is, it's so, it gets so crazy, overwhelmingly complicated. Oh my god, my controls are all fucked up. Ka Kakon tried buffing V Trigger 1 with Ibuki a few times, but that V Trigger is just. Just doesn't work well. Because both her V triggers are like tool V triggers, they're not like installs. Holy cow, dude, can I go through this door? Okay, what is up? What is left? Jesus. Just so you guys know, it's not even opposite controls, it's random controls. What? It's meaningless? Cures... Poisoning. Aren't I poisoned? Do I need a stronger... Need a stronger cure or something? Man, I'm losing so much health. Oh shit, I can fall down here. Oh, is this the start? The serum? I only bought one of these. Deadly poisons. 
Oh, damn, I didn't realize. I thought that was a key item. Calling's definitely getting nerfed a thousand percent. Well, what's left do you want them to nerf about her? Like, nerf her V-Trigger 2 again? Not too many people even play Pauline anymore. Make it three bars? Yeah, the three bars I can agree with. You'd have to buff the duration though if you did that. More recovery on our heavy buttons? Either have more even either have more recovery on the heavy buttons or have a lingering hurt box easier to whiff punish her. Didn't they do that last time though? LC, do you ever enter tournaments? Are you are you plan are you planning to go competitive this year? Is that the enemy? Oh my god, that poisoned me? I don't have a serum, I'm screwed. Oh, there's a platform on the left side there. Bounced? Oh my god, dude, I'm so screwed. If I would've knew about that serum, I would've bought nine of them. If he gets the buffs he truly deserves. Man, Gage, they're gonna have to buff him a lot, dude. They would have to buff his stomps. Buff his EX Tatsu. It's over here. This is insane. Like, this poison is so nuts. It lasts, like, forever. It literally does, like, 200 damage to you. If you don't have a serum, you're fucked. Look how much damage it's doing. Like, I can't even do this dungeon, dude. Everything poisons you. Dude, I'm taking like 400 damage. If it lasts forever, we literally can't do this dungeon. I wish there was a fireball game in Street Fighter 5. <laughs> I mean... There definitely is if you play Guile. Dude, this is ridiculous! <laughs> Without that serum, I'm fucked! That's the first time we died in this game. Holy fuck. When was the last time I saved? Saved in the dungeon. We're gonna have to leave. Yeah, we have no choice. It, it, the poison lasts forever. It. That's ridiculous. Where can we buy a serum, though? 
I don't think it was anywhere in Freedom unless they expanded the shop. Let's see. Oh, yeah, they did. Well, we might as well buy nine of those too in case we get screwed over by that as well. Yes, please, nine. Oops. No, we're good. It, the, the, this town expanded its shop. So we're Gucci. Yeah, thank goodness. How big is this dungeon, Jaeger? Do you know? Did I get the shoes yet? Yeah, I did. I'm asking because I, I have the bounce things. I gotta watch a movie. Well, like I said, whoever gets buffed and nerfed with this patch, let's just hope we get a meta change here. Some type of musical chairs would be nice. game considered better than Soul Blazer? From what I've read, this game is supposed to be like one of the greatest action RPGs on the Super Nintendo. Deepest. Oh, it's definitely deep. Can't deny that. This is Quintet's, like, magnum opus story that they wanted to create. Fuck, I can't use my items. I could be dead here. Magic Anchor? What the fuck is that? Secure footing in swift currents. Okay. Fuck, I gotta equip this then, I guess. I don't- I don't know, Zach. We're gonna decide, like, last second. Probably something new, relatively new. Okay, so there's gonna be like... Oops. Oh, I didn't use it during the waterfall. I guess there would be something that's gonna be pushing me, I gotta use it for that. Uh, how do I hit these guys, Jaeger? The eyeballs. There's nothing to the right. Here's where I died.
No, I got confused. Just ignore them? Okay. Gotta heal again, dude. Definitely a difficulty spike in this area. And I'm super over leveled, too. That's the crazy part. Back to the starting. Whoa. Top left is where I came from. Like, we're obviously looking for that person that was screaming for help. Yeah, see you, Micro. Guess I go this way this time. first. It's a good place to grind money, too. All good, Bunky. Enjoy your weekend, man. Shit slows me. Whoa! A stack of money? It's the first time I've ever seen that. Okay, it is the grinding spot. How do we get that? As you rock, can I climb this? Geo staff. I doubt it's stronger than my weapon. Our weapon's so cracked. Yeah, it's close though. Might be good against these enemies though. for the Magiro? Fuck my controls. What was the point of that? It's gotta be a trick or something here. Let me try throwing one of the rocks down there or something. Looks like there's a crack in the water, like it wants me to drain the water down. Grab this. Okay, okay, okay. And that's how we get the magic rock? That's super Zelda-ish? Yeah. Definitely. Okay, where are we now? It's a banger! It's a Whoa, banger. about to start thanks for the another bang. five bones, bro.
Thanks for the donos. So the witch cow can we create CPT tournament mode, talk about where it would display when on, and remove banned stages and costumes from the selection. Yeah, you know, I, I always thought about- we used to have tournament modes in some fighting games actually, where you can make it easier for the tournament organizers and all that. The only problem with that is like it has to be updated, right? Because we change our rules as more costumes and things get added and blah blah blah. I'm assuming we need to use this anchor here at some point. Nice! Finally some armor! This probably why I'm taking so much damage. Oops, wrong category. Up 11. There we go, boys. Thank god. That was huge, huge upgrade. We've been looking for a new armor for so long. Okay, there's a path here. What's up here? Hey, I can hurt them now. So what does that mean? I can only hit them when their eyes are open? I swear I did that before. Nice, I can't even fucking see if their eyes are open here. I'm not lost yet, surprisingly. Why can't I jump down here? I'm about to be lost pretty soon though, I think. This is the bottom of the waterfall. Oh, you can have full inventory? Yeah, I think I might be lost now, Jaeger. I just got the armor. Big upgrade. I need to figure out what I need to use this item for that I have. Unless there's something I'm missing up here. now. The breathing leaves all the way back there. What the hell's the point of this area? Dude, that's like all the way back at the start of the dungeon, though. Anything else open up here?
It's the other way. Pretty much have my bearings on this dungeon, though. Pretty good bearings of where I am. This area's not too confusing. Dropping the waterfall, the southeast one. Oh, I know you, which I know which one you're talking about. I was looking at it. I was thinking of going down there, but I remember I went down there at the very beginning. You're talking about this one, right? Wait, I've been here before, though. This leads me back up here. Go up right? Okay, that's where I came from. Okay. This is where we found the... There's someone calling for help here. When you say swim down, you mean go to the waterfall? Like the left wall? Yeah, this is where I got the chest. Yeah, I already got this. Yeah, I already got that. I just don't know what to use it for. We're going through all the steps? Yeah, no problem, man. No problem. Completely backtracking. Okay, this is where I knocked down that waterfall. That triggered the water. Uh-huh. Then you want me to go right? <laughs> yeah, when you told me to go back to the breathing leaves, I could have just literally not moved. Because you're leading me all the way back to when you first said that sentence. <laughs> I'm literally going back to exactly when you said that sentence. Okay. Okay, we're now in the big water area. Now what? Oh yeah, okay, okay. I mean, you could've just asked if I had the damn ball and chain.
We literally went in a giant circle. Drop all the way down. No! Drop all the way down, no. He had to go up left first. Go up okay. So drop from this angle? Creeping. All the way up left. I already went there. This leads to the bottom of the waterfall. Jaeger. This leads to the bottom of the waterfall. Where you told me not to fall down. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> I could have fell down. Okay, now what? Oh! Oh! Shit! I would have been stuck here for the rest of my life. Oh, that's brutal. That is fucking brutal, dude. Oh, shit. Okay, that's cheap. Yeah, we literally went around in a giant circle, but it paid off. I fell for the old behind the waterfall meme. What do I think of the dungeons in this game? Very simple at the beginning, and then they start to turn super cheap. You have to play this game very observant. What the fuck? Wait, can I climb up here? The Illusion of Guy only had one dungeon that confused the hell out of me. That was the one with the secret dungeon call where you. Where you run under the staircase? Or you slide under the staircase? That was the worst. Nah, no, I'm just being thorough, Jaeger. That one is ass. If this game had more of this, that'd be sick. And not... Village Simulator. Oh no! Cheeks. Oh, a child would never make it this far. I wouldn't make it this far. Damn, that thing better not hit me. What the hell is this anchor thing for, Jaeger? We never even used it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uh, do I get to fight this guy?
Uh, did I soft lock the game? What? I don't understand your language. Holy cow. Who's this? Yahoo! I'm Will. Oh, this is the guy who invented the plane. And he crashed here? Oh yeah, into the Great Lakes. You were so confused where he was, Jaeger, and he was here. Oh god. Oh no. Until the price of metal comes down, I'm stuck. Oh no. Foreign trade. Oh my god. So what the hell is this item for? This magic anger is driving me crazy. That's a chest? Tin sheets. Oh no. I didn't even notice it because it just blended in with literally everything else. Okay, he's taking a break because he can't afford more metal. God. Alright, let's hit the inn and flush this game. You can run with the running shoes? What do you mean? A mystic anchor that's under the Great Lakes? If you have it, you won't get washed away in the rapids? I don't remember. Don't save? Holy cow. Maybe without that item I would've got like pushed around or something in the water. I just didn't realize because I had it equipped. Let yourself get killed? What the hell? Mm, I could just go there manually, but... No, we gotta stop it here. We're, we're getting overtime now. Okay, I have no idea where we are or what we did last. It's been like, what? Two weeks since we played this game? I don't know why this guy's head's shaking. I forgot the name of my main character. I think we were supposed to go to China. I forgot the controls. We need to get this village simulator game done. If anyone is watching this on YouTube, know that this is the last retro game that we're going to play for 95 on stream. And then after that, it is going to be no limits, no year requirement. We're going to go ham. 
before Street Fighter 6 comes out, which is imminent. So let's get this done. Jaeger, take the wheel. What am I even doing here in this area? I forgot what like equipment I have. Starfish boss? I don't remember. All I know is that I got steel or something and I was supposed to go to China. That's all I remember. See, we got steel here. Tin sheet. And you told me to pick it up from the camera- from the guy who's building the plane, remember? You're like, Oh, there's a steel tin sheet there, grab it. Look at all my key items, what the hell do we do? Oh yeah, the royal letter, we got ditched. We got paintings, we got all this crap. I expected the last 95 to be not this. It wasn't supposed to be, but... Now that Street Fighter V is actually hype. Now that Street Fighter V is actually hype. We're actually finding matches. And it looks like we'll be playing that game most of the week. There is just no time now. We have to make sacrifices. Otherwise we'll never get to play Resident Evil 4. Street Fighter 6 will come out and be like, Guys, remember when we tried to get to 96 and we failed? I don't want that story. Okay, where am I? I'm in- am I in Southeast America? Wait, how do I get back on the boat? Nine if I was gonna be even longer? Oh yeah, dude. I- there was like 25 games left to play on stream. 25. It was still short, a uh, smaller list than 94, but still had a bunch of games regardless. We played most of the important good ones, though. There's like two longer ones that we didn't play. Secret of Evermore, uh, which I had played actually a couple years ago, recently. Evermore was fun to play with my cousin. Uh, Secret of Mana 3. Second Densetsu 3. We had to play that with Qual. Qual played that recently too. And, um. A bunch of fighting games that are like sequels that are kind of like mild expansions. Uh, a bunch of Saturn games we still had to play. Okay, thanks, Jaeger. I'm assuming China is over here. Is this China? Yes. Go to the inn. Here's a hotel. Upstairs. Looks like downstairs, but definitely looks like downstairs. No good man come here. This room for ladies. Sleep long time. Oh, is it she need the medicine? I will protect Ellie. Okay, I'm gonna give her the medicine. Uh Tact Bell, pretty flower. Fever medicine. Okay. What's up, cheese? Doctor lived that way. He say he needs something to make her better. Okay, I go talk to doctor now. Are you sure? Are you sure? Supposed to go here first, Jaeger? They said to go to the doctor. the tourist thing.
Oh, I understand. Okay. So, hotel. Doctor. Medicine. She is suffer. She cannot escape her nightmare. Sounds like me. An herbal medicine called ginseng could end your friend nightmare. No more ginseng. Okay, what do I do now, Jaeger? I'm on another fetch quest. Not here, the one on the right? I gotta talk to another doctor? Wait, what? Is this a secret house? He not talk to you, though. What I want. Ginseng. I have no business anymore. You go away now. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Flashback. But won't he leave town one day? No one know where he go. Somebody buy Dragon Castle, I think Wong. I don't know. But I also hear not good things. I hear he buy up many things and keep them at Dragon Castle. Oh no. God. This, this game took such a dark turn. Sure care about your brother. You a good man. We got ginseng. Alright, do I still need to go in the house of the right, Jaeger? Or is this the one you were talking about? Doctors does this town have? You want listen? Sure. You listen good to people. Oh god, everyone's talking about this castle. Oh, we got the speed shoes. It's on the first floor. Are <sighs> you supposed to like remember and figure all this stuff out yourself? What the hell? We abandoned our newborn daughter in a field? Oh my god. Oh no. Wait, who is this? I don't even know who this is. How would they even know if they're his daughter? I grabbed the magic rock already. Magic rock can't escape from me. Oh god. Let this fetch quest be over. Wait, do I. Are you sure I come here? I have ginseng in the medicine.
What do I give her? Aren't I supposed to mix the ginseng? Yeah, aren't I supposed to mix it? I'm not gonna give her a ginseng root. Then I gotta go back to the doctor, I'm assuming. Oh god. You got some ginseng. You make sick person in drink this, but be careful. It no good just drink ginseng. You get rid of cause of bad dream too. You try hard. What the hell? What the hell do I have now? Wait, what? I don't get it. Okay, I guess the item didn't change. We're just gonna imagine that the ginseng root is now a drink. You said to make her drink the ginseng. Then remove the nightmare's cause. Think about it? I better think a bit more. What do I do, Jaeger? Do I give her the drink anyways? Or do I get teleported into some boss fight? I think this teleports me to a boss fight. Because it's asking me, which means we'll see what happens. Uh-oh. Here we go. Oh no. Oh god, no. Oh no. We found no trace of the treasure. Oh no, not the village that's gonna get burnt. There is a treasure. I am merciful. <laughs> Give a chance to the village head. Kill them yourself. They are nothing but innocent villagers! Oh, fighter. You disagree with me, then? Uh-oh. Total surrender. Or death. <laughs> the conflict. Uh-oh. I came too. Oh no. Uh-oh. They're helping her. This game's not for kids. Are we close to finishing this? I don't know. 
but we must. I will not end this stream until we're done this game. does not absolve me of my crimes. So dark. Yo, what's up, Shred? Oh no. Dragoon Castle. All points lead to Dragoon Castle. Oh, happy music again. Wait, I just realized something. Jaeger, that's Fida. <laughs> I just realized that just now. What is she doing in China? Holy cow, the epiphany. I was not ready for that plot twist. But if Fida is there... <laughs> hey, give me a break. I haven't played this game in two weeks. But if Fida is there, then where the hell is uh, Ellie? Why can't I talk to the dude on the skateboard? Wait, what is, what is the kid doing in China? Castle. Full frontal assault. Oh, I'm assuming he's gonna help us get into the castle. The plot thickens. Do I finally get to like play the game? Oh no, the music screwed up. Yeah, we're streaming early because we need to get this game done today, so I can move on to uh, No Limit Retro. That's what we're calling it, by the way. That sounds good. No Limit Retro. <laughs> Let's go. I never even tried going into this castle yet, so I don't even know what he needs to distract for. Oh, this guy. Copy that. What's going on? The guy's got a searchlight like Metal Gear. What the hell? Oh my god. I told you it's Metal Gear time. Is that the music screwing up again? Mm -hmm. 
Oh! Yeah, let me exit the, the area real quick so to make sure the music's not bugged. Or where was the entrance? Oh really? So dude, I didn't notice. Let me let me go back to that room then. Yo, what's up, BMAC? that sound you're playing infinite again jeez man there's so much better games to play there's gotta be something else to play bro yeah you're right it did take out the candles good eye I'm playing Street Fighter again. It's awesome getting matches again. I hope it lasts until Street Fighter 6 beta. I mean, at least Halo Infinite's getting a new map. You know, so you got you got at least got something to mess around with. Must be too here too early. On top of that, I see nothing else to throw and take out these candles. I can't even use my weapon in this area. You guys like my uh, thumbnail for my controller video today? <laughs> Made me smile. Yeah, that, that thing I use in the thumbnail, it's a real thing. It's a real controller holder thing. It's pretty funny. Ah! Marvel Infinite? I haven't talked about Marvel Infinite at all. Or you're at least talking to somebody else. Oops. Oh, it just kicks me out. Damn, I'm hesitating too much. This guy has no pattern at all! Like, what kind of guard is it? He's just randomly looking in different directions. Oh, Marvel Infinite. Oh, okay. I understand. What? Where do you go? Oh my god. No! I needed to move just close enough so I can see where the hell he was. What's up the center path? Oh, this is a nightmare. Well, 
What's on the far right path? What? He's not even staring at me! Damn. It's literally random. Oh, thank God. Do you want me to tell you where to go? If I get lost, like, so far, I'm, you know, I haven't explored everything yet. This guy's just too slow. Whoa! This game took a super dark turn. You missed out on a lot of cutscenes. I streamed early quad because I need to get this game done, dude. But, uh, I found out that the girl who's sick in the bed in China is Fida. I didn't know until I saw her nightmares. And then I had nightmares. And we're playing Metal Gear right now. This game was ahead of its time. Ah! There's more to come. Yeah, and then, uh, what else did we do? Um... What else did we do? We went to China, we got ginseng, we found out about this guy's brother. We also found this family that left their daughter in a field. And we found out where she was, she was in this nomad village. Abandoned by her parents. There's so much dark shit in this game. The girl that couldn't talk? Wait, was it the girl that couldn't talk? <laughs> That's why you do this side quest. Oh, I want to play the game, okay? Yeah. And, and, and Jaeger is helping me. I had to literally, like, message him and make sure he's there. So I can beat this game tonight. That is the game. This game is nothing like the other two. Quintet games. It's totally different. Oh, Maggie Rock. Yo, Kwa, I saw you playing some KOF. What are you doing in KOF? I'm gonna check top lot right there. How long am I going to stream until I beat the game? We're getting this done tonight. Two hundred gems! I was just mashing button with a friend. Did you get a throne claw and wake up? Like I told you, the secret tech I found for KOF is when you have them when you have them in the corner claw instead of small hopping meaty towards them you small hop meaty straight up so they're not in throw range that's the secret tech once you realize that then your corner game goes up by like 10 million points chest. Large bulb. 300 gems. So Kuo, what do you want to do about this uh, Seiken Densetsu 3? I mean, we don't have to play it soon. I'm just kind of wondering where your head is at because you played it recently. So I'd like to play with you and talk some shit. I don't care, it's up to you since you guys stream Street Fighter. Yeah. I don't, like like I said, during the weekdays, like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursdays, Qua. Uh, you know. I'm still gonna play retro. 
But during the weekends and stuff, Street Fighter for sure. Because the matchmaking is really good right now. I do want to stream Mario 64. I'm gonna do Resident Evil 1 Remake first, and then Mario 64. Mario Party Online? We could do that. <laughs> I mean, I owe it to myself to do that. Oh, I don't even know what this is. Wait, what? How, what space is this taking up? Can't be armor. Am I maxed on weapons? Am I maxed on weapons? No. I'm overloaded. I can't carry anything more. I have to dispose of some weapons, armor, items. Do I- You're maxed on the outside ring, the spears. So I have to get rid of a weapon? So should I get- just get rid of one of the really weak weapons? Like, uh... Like this cry spear? Not the inside. What's the inside about? Inside means the strongest weapons? Light rod? Light rod's minus 29, this is minus 41. Okay, both you guys say light rod. Okay. Do whatever, man. Okay. Uh, how do I move it? Trash what? Can I trash that? Okay. And then you said trash what? Trash or... The raw spear. And the cry spear. Okay. Now what do we see we got? Three part rod. Is that a weapon? Hey it is. Is it stronger than this? 44. It is. Cool. I thought we only got spears in this game. I wouldn't have thrashed the cry spear. Really? I don't know if I can rewind it in time. So what spear? You said... Brass spear and hex rod? I don't even see the hex rod. What are you talking about, Jaeger? Yeah, I don't have the hex rod. I don't know what you're talking about. Then the sticker? Good night, Shred. Only in this shit range can you have a 50% to win rate on 200 plus games and be hard stuck. <laughs> BMAC, you have no right to bitch now. Remember, you asked for this. You came back. Okay, 
I guess I'm going back now, but it was worth it for that weapon. Okay, I'm going up the middle door now, Jaeger. In the main hall. That's a really hard angle to, to run. Is this guy gonna see me when I'm running down like this? No! I oh, screw it. It's faster anyways. I'm gonna say just like you slayed the Street Fighter 5 in the dark times. Hey man, I had an excuse though. I did content for Street Fighter 5. I had to cover that game. That was my livelihood. Like, what is this guy doing? Oh my... Oh my god. No! Oh! Oh shit! That's so stupid that it's random. Wait, what? It didn't put out the candle. Can I push this? Okay, there's obviously a secret here. It involves candles, maybe. Get the statue? Did you hear that? I heard that chant. What? I, I'm using the running shoe. Oh, I didn't even use the running shoes yet. I didn't even know you can use them like that. I thought it was just only for certain spots. Hopefully I didn't miss any other secrets because of that. Oh man, that could have been so much useful yeah, if you told me that before, I could have used it to run past those guys. Shit. There's a door there. The door there. Check the one on the right first. I need to restart the game now? I think so. Whoa! I can't jump while running, hey? Okay. You, so you told me you can use the shoes. But I thought it was for like this specific like wind spots or something, okay? I'm saying you should have clarified I can use them anywhere right away. That's all I'm saying. Oh my god, it's early! Oh my god. Wait, I thought she couldn't talk.
So I can keep doing my thing? I haven't missed anything? Oh my god! What the hell? Oh no! Payback! Oh no! What do you mean I didn't fool <laughs> What the hell? This bitch is crazy! Oh my god! He's a psycho! I don't know what to say, Jaeger. If I say yes, she's gonna go even more cuckoo. I did not say I didn't like her back. She literally went into my dreams and created an illusion. She's doing gaslight on the next level. <laughs> I was with another girl before I even met her. So how the hell is that cheating? Let me out of here. To you, you'll have to suffer for hurting my feelings. I work for Mr. Wong. He gave me this order. Lose Ark forever in this dark and cold dungeon. Oh no. Oh my god. Holy cow. Useless twit. Mm -mm -mm. Oh no, it's Wong. Hey, and it's that other dude. Why does Wong care about King Henry? Wait, what? I'm so confused. Didn't Kaida kill everyone? Yeah, catch up with the story. I don't know what's going on. I don't understand anymore. Guilty or innocent not matter. Necessary or not is problem. That day will come when only necessary people will live forever. <gasps> Natural selection. You love talking on the you tell me honestly. Everyone wants this damn treasure. You bodyguard, you keep watch on Oh, he's a hired gun. Why? I don't understand how Wong's involved, and I don't understand why she's saying that Wong is the one that murdered her village. That makes no sense. Exposition. Who knows? I'm just a drifter working for a fistful of gems. <laughs> it will be explained later. I heard that once in Metal Gear, Jaeger, and that was not true. I'm gonna soak. <laughs> you guys are useless. Nobody here. <laughs> Wait, how did Fida recover from her fever so quickly?
What if I jump and miss the chain? Should I not tell her about the crazy psycho girl? Apparently Juan has been involved in more stuff than we expected. Juan is the owner of this castle and he has been scalping all the minerals for unknown reasons. Okay. Self-centered brat for a bit. Airplane parts? <laughs> I came here for airplane parts. Our objectives coincide. Okay, what? What now? Do I go back in this area to see if there's anything I, mi I missed? Or do I go all the way back to the beginning of the dungeon? Oh, there's a magic rock here. You said I missed nothing! There's like a magic rock right here! <laughs> oh my god, torture keeper! Except that. <laughs> okay, that was it. And speedrunners must really like it when they get these shoes. the shortcut. Damn it. Not intentional. No! Jesus. It's so annoying. It's so hard to like creep up on the screen and see what direction he's facing. It just appears out of nowhere. I can't see which direction he's facing. Yeah, the speedrunners, I mean, unless there's some kind of crazy high percentage pattern or something, I don't know. Ugh! Okay, good, I got ahead of him. Oops. Oh, there she is. Professor, what if I told you Barman was a good game? I'd ignore you. What's going on? Why is Ellie like a ghost now? Why are these chests open already? Or is this the treasure that people came here for?
Closed paths are to be opened by one's own feet and none other. <gasps> Speed shoes. Six lights illuminate a new world by losing six lights. <gasps> Candle puzzle. Oh no! Oh no. Damn it! Oh god. We gotta kill this girl. Once and for all. She's gotta get got. Oh no. This is a- um, yeah. Nightmare sneak into the gaps of people's hearts. Ark, <laughs> believe! <laughs> I can fight the illusion? The genjutsu? Oh no. Kill yourself. Take her out! Mm -hmm. He should suffer. And suffer. And suffer in the same way. Oh! <laughs> Keep Ark out your fucking... MOUTH! You're a child who should never be in love thinking that way. Oh my god, she made her cry! Oh my god. What a wuss. There are so many, like, storylines in this game. Uh-oh. The mouse they are caught. Oh no! You are no longer needed. What do you mean? He plans to kill us all in this room. I worked hard for Mr. Wong. The purely evil treat people like ants. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I was stupid. Oh! It's this kid! Wait, how did he blow up the wall? It's to get our job done and get out. We need to make the plane. Totally perfect for boarding. Wow. The skateboard is packed with dynamite.
Check the wall opposite the unpaired statue. Oh no, we have to fight Royd. I was wrong. She said sorry. Okay, now what? Do I go back to that area with the candles? On the left side? Oh, I already did this. I don't want to have to do it again. Okay, the st unpaired statues. Looks like a switch. That's it. Uh huh. Wait. Anything else I need in here? I'm going to assume this opens if I hit the switch, so... Chili down here, I'll turn my fan. I need heat. <gasps> there she is. She left me that nasty note saying to never see me again. Uh oh. We take this clown out. I harbor no ill will, but this is my business. Uh oh. Uh oh, no, not Fida! <gasps> it's personal. This entire dungeon, I've never had to use a single weapon. <laughs> oh no. I won't dupe you again. Hey, how's the princess able to keep up with my speed shoes? Even before that. Uh-oh. Oh no. Draw your sword.
Damn. So she ends up not fighting? Weird. Uh oh. No! Damn it! Oh no! God! She said that last time! Who the hell is Dr. Bur Baruga? Who the hell is that? And who's Moss? Now we know the name. You fire, <laughs> you fire. You couldn't have not known. Oh no. My closet! <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> what are these plot twists? <laughs> you... <laughs> Dude, there was like three story arcs uh, in the last two minutes. <laughs> you didn't know, but one of the people you killed was my best friend. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. This guy has this hidden agenda. <laughs> oh my god, this is so funny. <laughs> Yo, Qua, that mailing girl, she's a psycho bish. Oh no! <laughs> She's yelling crazy. <laughs> I thought she was with- oh no! I still don't know how the skateboard kid got to China. Uh oh. The Prince of Metal. I need that skateboard. Oh. Back to being alone. <laughs> Yeah, if we can get an airplane, that'd make the game so much easier to move around. Oh my god. I can't believe this game just literally, once you reach the halfway point, you no longer have gameplay. That entire dungeon had zero fighting. It was one just big text adventure. Go save and sleep? Oh no. I don't know why there's bugs in this inn. It's messed up. I don't know where the hell that is, Jaeger. Do I have to go back to the southeast on the US? 
I couldn't even gain a level because there was no monsters to fight. Isn't there a million side quests we still need to do, or should we get the plane first? What is Retro No Limit? <laughs> For the past two years, we started Retro on the very first year of gaming, in like the 60s. And we've been going year by year, every platform. We're about to finish 1995, and now we're gonna go no limit, no no year required. So we're gonna play a bunch of good games after this. Okay, where am I going? Who's Will? I don't know who the hell that is. Oh no, he calls it a burger. Oh my god, we invented burgers. And look, that's the guy who was shaking his head. I put grilled ground meat in a bun. It's delicious. Yeah, I'm confused. Is retro over? It's just begun. It has just begun. Oh, stretch my legs. Oh. No, I don't need your economic forecast. Go away. I guess it went up 10% because of the burgers. Yeah, he made his airplane, but wait, how does why did he make his airplane? Then we have the steel. Metal became available again. I should have never give up my dreams. Why did metal become available again? Because of the, the Dragoon Castle? Wait a second. This guy's teaching me how to fly an airplane? You know how dangerous that is? He was scalping minerals, metals included. In the castle? Where's the plane? How is he scalping minerals in that castle? I don't understand. Wait, did we talk to, uh, what's his name again? Hey, there's a runway here. Imagine if you went and killed the Ethereum King and video cards are available again. We didn't kill Wong though. I don't understand. We didn't kill him. So how did metal become available? I don't understand. Wait. We, well, technically, what's his name? Got revenge because he killed his best friend or something stupid.
What the hell is going on? This looks like pilot wings. Oh my god, we're flying. Wow! Okay, which side quest are we doing now? Okay, this is gonna make things a lot easier. Go to Japan. Japan would be over here. Wow, look how fast we are. This is Japan, right? No, that's New Zealand. This is Australia. Uh, hold on, don't worry, I know my geography. Uh, okay, wait. Japan's like northeast of Australia, isn't it? Isn't it? Okay, hold on. Don't tell me. Let me figure this out myself. This would be Japan. This is Japan. Right? How do I land? Oh. You need an airport to land? Says who? And how, how are they going to make... <laughs> Runways for an invention on a single plane. Okay, how do I land? Japan's right here. What do I do? What? Then going on the plane was a waste of time! Oh, we already went to Canada. That's where we talked to the penguins. Wow, look how big the town is now. It's huge. <sighs> Man, I can't wait to beat this game. Okay, where am I going? Japan. I'm going to Japan. Can you imagine if this game had random battles? Oh my god. Japan? Did you say that in the Street Fighter 2 announce your voice? When you reach Japan, look for the trash can. Okay. I'm glad you understood. Dude, I wouldn't be able to call myself a Street Fighter content creator if I didn't understand that. I'd be in shame. Wait, did I take a picture of this place? <sighs> did I take a picture of Japan? Trash can exploring raccoon. What? Is this a typo? Instead of data, it's supposed to be date? Have I went here before? Well, look, it's like <laughs> a game developer studio. Oh wait, it is. It's Enix. Never mind. Oh, no, we haven't explored here yet. You haven't been to Japan yet? That's weird.
Japan is entirely optional? That's crazy. Yeah, we better get it over with. That's foreshadowing, Jaeger. Not good. Hey, look, it's E-Trot! He talks in all caps. And traffic lights. What's in here? Wow, Magi Rock. That was a pretty good impression, Qua. Wow, when are we gonna get bubble tea? If I order bubble tea off Uber, it's like 20 bucks. Wait, what? Oh my god, a noodle eating minigame. That's the prize for King Noodle. Just get Uber? <laughs> it's so expensive. It's A and B, right? Booba tea? <laughs> I don't know what booba tea is, but bubble tea is like... Well... It could be... Actual tea or milk. Mixed with, uh... What's it called? Sago? Fruit? Bubble tea could be a lot of things. I am now the noodle king. I'm gonna get some right now. What the hell, Qua? Be right back. <laughs> what an asshole. Oh my god. I might actually order some. Now I'm really craving it. It's so expensive. Ugh. God. Maybe I'll ask Willie if he wants some. No, don't donate money to grab bubble tea. No, that's panhandling and I don't like that. Do not give me money for bubble tea. Someone, uh, is anyone watching Willie's stream right now? Maybe ask him if he wants me to order some bubble tea. Let's see what he says. <laughs> Shut up, Qua. Seriously, do not donate me money for that. I swear, if you donate me money, I'm gonna spend it on Halo Infinite microtransactions. I had- I quit this miserable job. If only I can say this, that's Ono. You're a one hip guy. Grilled chicken Japanese sake. One sake. Ooh. That's me after I drink bubble tea. Great. No, oh, no. A wild a animal. No, oh, no, I better not be a tanuki. Hell? 
Why are all uh, the Japanese people dressed as businessmen and women? Because, especially during the 90s, it's a very, like, you know, uh, I don't know what the word would be. Not business-like culture, it's a very, um... Well, what's the word I'm looking for here? Not career-minded? Salary man, yeah, that's what I'm looking for, yeah. It's a very, like, salary man, like, kind of culture, like, you... Soulless? <laughs> you guys are so mean. Like a lion here? What? I'm looking at the trash cans for like a raccoon or something, right? Who is this creepy guy? <gasps> Those trendy spots. Check it out. Oh my god. What? That's you. Oh my god, are we in the red light district? Uh oh, we are. Uh oh. We really are in Japan. <gasps> Wait, how do they have phones here already? I saw an awesome documentary video on the red light district. And they were like filming there like really late at night and they show some cr really creepy shit. And, uh, they were, like, trying to interview the girls, and then, like, this really s shady Yakuza guy would, like, walk up to me, like, Hey, you! Go away! <laughs> that was pretty funny. Explore this whole area. Yep, it's the noodle place. Yeah, I'm still exploring the town. I know about the trash cans, guys. What the hell? When she sees your hair dyed blonde. Oh my god. <laughs> Beast. There's a trash can over there. Who's this guy? He's got shades. What? Why do I wear shades inside? I have cute eyes that make me look nice. That's bad for my business. I see. It's F Champ? I was gonna say that was, uh, Itagaki. He's pretending to be a penguin. No. Oh. There's, uh, we're in Capcom HQ, and here's the guy, uh, Applying to work on the netcode. Do I want a tour? Here we go. Wow, look! Everyone's working. The genius scientist of Mosque. Oh, we, he hasn't revealed who he is yet. They strive for the truth. Damn, who is this guy? So he's a genius, that's all we know. 
Same guy work. Why? What's wrong with the strive lobbies? Willie was watching. <laughs> like I said, I was trying to see if Willie was interested in playing these nuts. And, uh, Willie was watching Sonic Soul stream. And then in between the match, Sonic Soul, you know, they have that arcade lobby that Arxis loves so much where everyone's in the arcade machine. And Willie's like, oh, I'm not this shit. When he saw it. Someone to help me, I'll never waste food again. Oh, he's stuck in the in the, in the trash bin. Wait, what the hell? Who wastes food? <laughs> oh my god! Who doesn't clean up their room? Ouch. Damn, these are all like bad things for kids. He started saying the same things all over again. sometimes the miserly ghost wait is that a word isn't it miserable ghost Jitters. I'm a game designer. I design games at Quintet. <gasps> I'll make you a game with you as the hero. I can see why this is Quas' favorite area. Hey, look, it's Quintet. And it's got a sad face. These guys really wanted to put their office in the game. <gasps> Illusion of Gaia too. <laughs> They're talking about how hard they worked. They're sad because they ran out of business. They didn't know that yet. Graphic designers. Oh, a Mac PC? Hey, dim sum. These nuts duel is too simple. No command normals, barely any overheads, one button specials. Yeah, but I heard it's got mad footsies. Why do they keep saying Illusions of Gaia 2, Qua? Because they're just talking about a game they want to work on?
<laughs> it's funny. They're trying to say this game is Illusions of Gaia 2. I'm... <laughs> what? As a rookie, I'm just a bit... A bit player, but I'll get big. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna have to... There's just so much going on in the FGC right now. Everyone's just, like, arguing about everything right now. The, the video where I talked about the controller today... Uh... A lot of people seem to like it, so I guess I'm gonna talk about some other shit now, too. I gotta talk about this whole free-to-play bullshit, and I need to talk about... ...some other DLC stuff. Someone left this comment that just triggered the fuck out of me, though. I really need to talk about it, too. M Max showed an example of, like... All the DLC in Tekken, like all the characters just talking about like, hey, fighting games are like that right now where there's tons of microtransactions and someone's like, yeah, look at this. And he showed all the DLC for Street Fighter V and it was like all the D uh, the CPT bundles. And my blood started to boil. And I'm like, oh, you f <sighs> Don't worry, I'll make a video on it soon. Hey, what's he say? Secret pet. Hey, is this the Chia pet? You guys remember that commercial? Ch 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 chia Welcome to my lab. That's our turtle, Vesper. I've never seen a turtle before. It's lonely here alone. If you think you have it, please help me. The problem with free-to-play, and I guess I don't want to spoil my video what I'm going to talk about, but... Everyone seems to think that free-to-play means that, like, you make this giant AAA quality game with content, and then you decide it's free-to-play after. I don't think people understand how this works. Hey, who is this? A debut is a woman programmer. Who the hell is she? <laughs> Penguin K. I'm almost human now. What the hell is going on in this studio? I wonder what I'll do with two whole holidays in a row. Maybe work? Dude, they're, these guys are like... Did, did, their, did their boss or producer know they made this section of the game? This is like their own little area to vent. These guys are all complaining about their jobs. You guys notice this? The problem is, is that a lot of the FGC don't actually play free-to-play games. Unless they're talking about gacha or mobile games, which are different. They don't really understand, like, what that means to make a fighting game free-to-play and what that sacrifices. And there's no way in hell a company like Capcom could even handle free-to-play, even if they wanted to. Well, the Killer Instinct is not even a free-to-play game, though. Like, that's not exactly what free-to-play is. It had great free incentives. 
but it wasn't a, like a. That's not the free to play model. The closest thing we have is Brawlhalla. Remember when Capcom released Cage and said they would do the season pass differently, then went dead silent for seven months? Yeah, and then you forgot to add and got spoiled on what they were saving it for. Um. Yeah. Okay, I'm flying to Russia. Did I see the bottom of Africa? I don't know. I'm pretty sure I did. I'm pretty sure Jaeger told me to go there one time. Because I found some hidden areas. I don't know, Jaeger will let me know. Well, I have recovered... Is Diablo Immortal even out, John? Did you even play that? Yeah, the problem- yeah, exactly. The problem with free-to-play is that it's not feasible, so it's like... I don't like talking about it much either. Because everyone's just talking about the best-case scenario, which is, like, impossible. Is it? What's the reference? Oh, I missed it. Uh, okay. Let me check the reference then. So what about all these other key items that I have, Jaeger? I got so many. Well, I'm not even talking the free- I'm not even t talking about free-to-play in, like, the sense of it being good for us. I'm just talking about it not being feasible for a company like Capcom. That's my main beef with it. Etra, why are you saying it's like Max is the only one that pushed rollback for fighting games? Like, what are you talking about? The entire world has been asking for rollback for like two decades now. Oh, South Africa, right. We're in South America. Not paying attention. That's on this side. Guys, the world exists outside of Twitter, in case you guys don't know. The real people that brought rollback were the people that actually worked on it, that helped these Japanese developers. Like the Cannon Brothers and shit. That sold their licensed stuff to Capcom and made the netcode. Those are the people. Not the people on Twitter. Like, what are you guys even talking about? Cape Town? Cape Town? You saw it, but you didn't look. You saw it, but I didn't look. Cape Town. I'm in the Sahara Desert. What's Cape Town? Go back to the ship, hit south. I'm looking for a, uh, a dock. It's the beginning area of Illusion of Gaia. Man, it's been too long to remember.
it is it the area where we had a bunch of friends that had a little hideout in a cave? Was that Illusion of Gaia? I'm trying to remember, it's been so long. Yeah, 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 okay. It wasn't Soul Blazer too. That I don't remember. So I can see it, but I can't go there, Qua. It's just an homage. Hey, there's like a sunken temple here. That's too bad. It'd be cool if you can like go to the actual town, Qua. Okay, where am I going? Jaeger? Russia. Russia is right here. A plague called Moscow. Oh, that's where the, the evil genius guy is. Literally not Moscow. Is there a landing strip, though? How am I going to land this thing? More southwest? Okay. Oh, right here. Perfect. Okay, how do we land this bad boy? Where do we go? Yay. But, like, the whole conversation, guys, between this free-to-play and DLC and whatever, you know, it's not like it's a harmful conversation. I just feel like it's kind of a waste of time to talk about it because it's not something that's feasible on a lot of these uh, Japanese developers. It's just not. Like, I don't think people understand the, the, the business logistics behind free-to-play, the size of the team you need the corners and quality you have to sacrifice to make it from the ground up. Like I said, I'm going to do a whole video about this, but it's not... Po if you understand free-to-play, you'll understand it's not possible. It just can't happen. It won't happen. So it's kind of like a waste of time talking about it. Like, talking about cross-play and, you know, rollback netcode is more constructive. That's crazy. He was sitting outside already. Are you talking shit? I'm <laughs> talking shit about the drivers? Damn. Don't worry, I left him a good tip. Okay, where am I going? Uh... They're making another Monkey Island game? That sounds cool. I really like Monkey Island. Go to the town next to the strip? Oh, this was the town right here? What happens if I go here in this little house? 
God, this game is huge, dude. Who's this? Oh my god, there's a cult going around here. Oh my god. Secret society? I'm gonna be a white disciple when I grow up. Jeez. This place is completely brain- Oh, she take a picture of this place. We can't? Why not? This would look amazing on the tourist attraction. Vesper, you seen these free-to-play talk in fighting games? <laughs> Here we go again, guys. Yes. I have, and I have things to say. And I will say them. Uh... <laughs> in a bit. I don't know, I'm kind of backed up on videos right now. It's kind of funny, but I actually have too many videos right now. For once. I came back because of Street Fighter 6, and now I literally release like three videos a day. A day, dude. Like, between patch notes, news... And discussion topics and match videos? I have too much content right now. My my YouTube channel is just spam. And on the Twitter side, I'm apologizing to people because I'm also uh, telling people about the uploads on the Retro channel. Because on the Retro channel, I just uploaded our whole Demon Souls run on the Retro channel, if you guys don't know that. So I'm like, every day on Twitter, I'm like posting like four videos. And it's like, people are going to unfollow me because I'm just spamming. Yeah, I'm jacked on content. I don't know, like I said, I just did the podcast with Jimmy and AM Kid. That's gonna be on the weekend. I gotta do an Alex gameplay video matchmaking video. Probably on Thursday. Mir has a video talking about a very delicate topic. Again. This time it's not one frame links, but uh let's just say it has to do about DPs and how they were different before. And then, this free-to-play talk, oh god, I don't know. I'll have this video probably by next week. We'll see. I'm not saying free-to-play doesn't work for fighting games. I'm saying it's not possible. Like, I'm saying if you had a team and a company that was dedicated to it and completely understood how it worked, you can do it. But I'm saying there is no company right now that can do it or handle it. The only, the only company that can handle it is Riot. Besides Brawlhalla, there's going to be Project L, and that will be the next one. And I guess, uh, multiverse. But I don't even know if multiverse will work. But that's it. I know this because I play a lot of free-to-play games. I play almost every Battle Royale. And of course I played League. I've seen the good and I've seen the ugly. And I know what it takes. And I'm sorry, Japanese developers don't know anything about it. Free-to-play games and how to handle it. They don't. It's not the same as gacha games at all. I guess I, I don't want to spoil the video, but dude, it, I'll put it this way, okay? Free to play games require a giant player base that does not stop playing. If they stop playing, if you lose somebody, you lose money. You lose a lot of money. And with Street Fighter V, with Street Fighter V, how bad it was at the beginning and how much of their player base they lost. You have to understand that it doesn't matter if you played Street Fighter V for, you know, three hours and said, fuck this game. Or if you're like me and played it for six years. We both gave Capcom the same amount of money. You bought the game, you gave them the money, they got an instant return on their investment. Free to play is not like that at all. Okay, 
What do we have here? Red armor. I don't want to buy armor because we always find better armor in dungeons. 50 gems. What a ripoff. Well, the thing is, Saddle, once again, I don't want to talk about this too much, but... People see these successful free-to-play games, right? Like Brawlhalla. And it excites them. It, I mean, it excites me. The idea of uh, casting this giant wide net and that, but... You have to re you have to realize the the logistic realities of it. It's not some charity thing. It's a it's a it's a it's something that has to be planned from the ground, built from the ground up. And free to play guys, a lot of free to play games fail a lot. And there's a lot of companies that that do it that have no fucking idea what they're doing, like three four three. And. It took the, the Western developers a very long time to get it down, and only a few survive. And the ones that do survive are giant, giant, mega, mega corporations compared to fucking Capcom. Minus 80 life? You, it doesn't... There's like hidden uh, minus life in this game, cool. He built a castle. I do not fear death. I have total faith in Bruga's words. Oh my god. Be right back, something came up. Perfect timing, Jaeger. I'm only in the heart of the enemy territory. Whoa, is that Bruger right there? rife with corruption. Oh, you wanna... What the hell? He perfected DNA engineering to fully cure... What the hell? Recurring disease. Excuse me. Oh my god. Nano machines? Oh my god, everyone wants to be immortal. the words. Now what? Do you know where to go, Claw?
They said there was something south of the lake or something. South of the lake. Oh, right here. Oh my god, a fighting area. Dude, I feel like it's been... We need to go through like three playthroughs to finally get here. Oh my god, this area is huge. Well, am I in the right place? We need to restore power. How would our game know anything about power? Just fighting this game? Apparently, yes. Oh, there we go. Power restored. So all these robots. Mass production. <coughs> I'm getting like secret of mana vibes in this area. Let's go back to the elevator. Oh, let's grab my shoes. <clears throat> Chrono Trigger area? Yeah, I'm getting like Mana Fortress vibes. And yeah, Chrono Trigger too. <laughs> oh, the power didn't get restored here. Okay, so not yet then. Oops. So we're missing something here. Just double checking all the areas. Oh, there's a... Uh... So like they have a pencil over there. Oh, we have to crawl under here. Clever. There we go. What is this for? Ouch. I wonder how much XP these guys get. Get the money. Yeah, so I guess that was for the elevator. Is MK11 Ultimate worth my money? 
Well, I don't play Mortal Kombat anymore. But there's so much content out for it. I'm sure you can, like, just watch and kind of decide if it's for you. Are you a Mortal Kombat player? And that's kind of interesting. They put the bucket thing here, guys, just so you can see it when you're running down, so you know you have to go here. It's really clever. Clever game design. I mean, I'm pretty sure the, there's still a lot of people playing Mortal Kombat. At least on the casual side. And there's a lot of content in it, too. If you like uh, doing the single player stuff. But I honestly don't play Mortal Kombat anymore, so... I know they, like, they're not updating it anymore. Like, this is it, so... You have to have internet to play all single player modes. Single player modes. Let me try. Welcome to like 10 years ago, bro. I gotta use that other spear. There's no way. That'd be too crazy. Sir, I've been the only one complaining about how fighting games don't have enough single player stuff. What do you mean? Welcome to 10 years ago. I'm just saying, have you ever played a Blizzard game before? supposed to figure that out this dungeon's hardcore I did figure it out you are right but come on man it's cheap oh, where are these guys I don't know they got jetpacks super off calls with bison on the left side of the screen switch the pad and thank god that problem was solved or a stick that's interesting i mean it's very common to have a, a best side or whatever for fighting games it's just the way our our hands are shaped Yeah, another thing that matters too is like, it's not just to shape your thumb, but do you use the tip of your thumb or the middle part of your thumb, right? I use the middle part of my thumb. 
Did you get the be uh, the beaver D pad? Cause I was gonna order it, but the the delivery fee was insane. The shipping cost is more expensive than the D pads themselves, which is really annoying. Teleporters. There is a very slight edges you get for a joystick or for a pad, but they're so small that it's not a big deal. Like playing on on pad, for example, the dash is can be a little bit faster because you don't have to return the neutral or you can return the neutral so quickly but we don't know if street fighter 6 is even gonna have good dashes same with charge characters right the advantage is so small just like joysticks have an edge on like characters with piano or complex motions like in kof Everyone will have Yoka teleport exactly. <laughs> Level up. That's okay, man. I'm always around. I'm streaming like every day. Is this gonna teleport me to that one that leads to nothing? So this is all for nothing. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to send the elevators up now. Let's go check out this elevator is working now. Absorbed by cube. Oh my god, that did so much damage. Okay, cube, very strong. Hmm. 
Now what? Is that not a bridge? You have to crawl under something. Let's see the teleport and the conveyor boat. It's obviously got to be something here. Oh, I can jump on here. Okay. This is very specific. I got a damage nerf? Oh, I did. Is it considered a curse? I don't know what the other area. Did I lose it? Okay. It's just a curse for one area. Belong to the database. <clears throat> oh no, a password. Bloody Mary. history. Dawn of humankind! I don't know. Super cold hibernation device. Spell Doom. Hmm. Oh, dude, Fear the Walking Dead. Oh, oh, that show is so terrible, dude. Oh, God. Horrible. Basement 3 is under construction. <clears throat> Interesting. So why is there a future lab that exists in a world where telephones and planes are just being invented? They had such an amazing opportunity with Fear the Walking Dead. Such an amazing opportunity. But they blew it. Like, 
they had an opportunity to show the outbreak as it happened. But then they did the exact same bullshit. The outbreak starts and then it does a giant time jump, which is stupid. Also, it goes from the perspective of like a bunch of citizens again. Who gives a fuck? It would be way more interesting if it showed it from a perspective of either like uh, more important people, like a, from the scientist perspective, from uh, a government perspective, or a military perspective. But it's just the same shit. It just, it pisses me off. It's like, I don't know, these writers, like, I don't understand how these guys get paid for a living to do this shit. I'll still never watch any of Walking Dead. Dude, if you're gonna watch it, just watch the first two seasons. And if you like it, you can go a little further. There are some key, there's some Kino characters, but the further you go, the worse it gets. The first season in particular is very good because it's directed by Frank Darabal, but then he started feeling himself and went immensely over budget AMC canned his ass. And he's like, you know who the fuck I am? I directed Shawshank Redemption. Yeah, I would I would argue that the governor, the TV show governor, is better than the comic book governor. He pulled a Hideo Kojima. Well, the problem is that AMC is those guys are like. They're cheapskates. Like, they want to go so low budget but have all these episodes. And Frank Darabout wanted to really go hard on the character development. So he wanted these episodes, he wanted there to be a constant flashback of what their lives were before the outbreak and after. So there could be a lot of flashback episodes, right? What their life was like before. But to do that, to jump between different settings like that requires a higher budget. And AMC didn't want to do that. And Frank Darabout's like, well, fuck y'all. And then he bounced. And now Walking Dead is literally directed by a different director every episode. <laughs> so when you have a different director every episode, there's a lot of um, inconsistencies with the episodes. Some episodes you'll be like really artsy. Some will be action packed. Uh, it's, yeah. I've watched the entire Walking Dead series twice up to this point so i've seen the crash and burn in slow motion why did breaking bad have a high budget or did it um i'm not sure I don't... I mean, there was definitely a, a, a budget for Breaking Bad, because there's a lot of, like, action scenes in it, too. But there's a lot of slow scenes, too. Breaking Bad and even Better Call Saul has a lot of montage scenes. But I do know that um, the director slash writer... And that's a big thing, too, is that... What's his name? Vince Gilligan or some shit? You guys have to remember that Frank Darabout and Vince, whatever his name is, that did Breaking Bad, they both directed and wrote the show. You know, that's a big deal. I mean, like I said, a really good movie or TV show requires a really good harmony. If someone, if someone, if someone's not doing their job, the whole uh, show falls apart. You know, you need a good, like, editor to really, like, you know, perfect what you're trying to write or convey. And you need a good writer. You need good actors. You need a good director to lead the actors and blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? Like, it's a big, it's a big project, right? But, uh, AMC begged Vince to make Breaking Bad go longer. He, they begged him, man. 
They wanted, they're like, please, just do at least one more season. And he told them to go fuck themselves. And they wanted it to drag on. Yeah, of course he did the right thing. I haven't seen that yet, Zach. Yo, Zach, what was with you creeping when we were watching, uh, Screen 5? You didn't say anything, you just there creeping. Were you watching it with us? Yo, beer pack. Oh, yeah, Zach? Yeah, we watched Scream 5 in the Discord. Oh, no, is this a boss? Intruder alert. Not attack mode. Judgment is passed. I hit him in the in the in the, the legs. Oh my god, I'm toasted. I can't move. Whiplash attack. Yeah, it's 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 called Scream, but it is a direct sequel. So it is literally Scream Five. It it wasn't good, but it def it, but it wasn't like Resident Evil bad, you know. It was just okay. Vesper, you don't use magic. <laughs> Magic's for scrubs. Uh, I did use magic on one of the bosses, but I don't really need to. I'm so I'm so power leveled. Oh no, I got that curse. Uh, what stops the curse? Is it the serum? Holy water? Uh oh. Hey, what's going on, Subby? The problem with Scream 5 is that you just don't give a shit about any of the characters at all. And the characters are like, I really hate it when like Hollywood tries to portray teenagers or kids and they have no fucking clue how real people act and talk. It's really off-putting. Like. You hear these teenagers talk and they use all these like meta and and trendy words that you would only see on like Reddit or something. And you're like, who the fuck are these aliens? Like the way they talk is just not how real people talk and it's I hate it.
all the teenagers are played by 38 years old year olds. Yeah, sometimes it's a good thing though. Sometimes to get decent acting, it's hard if the characters are really young. Like, just we're we're just talking about Walking Dead. Like, the actor who plays Carl, like, that is a really really difficult role to play. If, especially the the scenes in like the comic book and shit. It's like it would almost be better if it was a 38 year old. You know, you would need a very talented kid to play that role. I don't know if he still he only streamed once. He streamed League of Legends. And everyone in the chat was making fun of him for being a uh, bronze rank. I was able to watch that stream for a little bit, it was funny. And he constantly ignored the chat when they were like talking to him about when they were making Carl jokes and shit. <laughs> he got really fucked over though. Like, really fucked over. Uh, by AMC. I can't really go into detail because it's like, you know, spoilers. Getting hit by that whiplash thing is brutal. Wow, I'm having trouble on this boss. Uh, do I have magic? attack oh no I, I haven't found a dude that sells it in so long I got three electric rings this electric ring you can't use magic here no noob magic allowed we gotta wait for my curse to wear out oh shit dude But one of the legs is damaged. Ah! Heal. 20 plus years, I still don't know what the status symbol is. What it stands for? What is moving? Suspension okay, it touched down. Oh no, I'm immobilized. No, I'm gonna get combo. Ah! Oh, shit. Burner ignition. Oh, I need to get magic. It turned into Metal Gear pretty much as soon as we did the last dungeon, the Dragoon dungeon. 
literally did turn into Metal Gear. It's weird. Okay, one more foot to go. The only problem is this attack is really annoying. Whoa. Iframes, please. Level up! The last gasp attack was unsightly. It had a self-destruct attack? Whoa, Zombos! Don't tell me he was in frozen stasis. There he is, he's chilling. What's his name again? Burger King? Thank you for arousing me. I'm a practitioner of science. When the world died, I took to a long sleep. Damn, so there, there used to be a world that existed, Qua, before this world. Where are you going? Why are you walking away from me? What else if I go through this teleporter? I created this life. Isn't it beautiful? With this system, people can live forever. Death is no longer fearful. Talk to the zombie in the nutrient bath. He even called him a zombie. He's like, hello. He looks sad. Is it really a happy thing to revive the dead? If people didn't die, the world would be filled up immediately. I have naturally taken that into account. The unnecessary shall die, and only the necessary lives. That's all. <gasps> Mate. Oh no! Uh-oh. The three laws of robots? They can't harm humans? It is! They must not harm people. Robots must protect people. If those conditions are not met, a robot must protect itself. Anyone deemed to be a threat to my person must be per terminated. Man, this guy is... Next level, this is an ultimate villain. This guy is too smart, Claw. This guy is Thanos? Kind of. Thanos was more like... He wasn't about natural selection. He was more like, 
50-50. And having a, a feasible amount of natural resources. Yeah, balance. Remember you showed that example of that planet thriving because it got rid of half the population? Hey, it's that guy from the very start of the game. Ark, you have done well to groom the world so far. Oh no. You'll make this world fantastic. <laughs> Your duty is finished! I got played? So, I'm... Who? This game is not for kids. I can't believe how long this game is and how big the scope of this game is. It's mind-boggling how big this game is. Who's this? Where the hell am I? The Star of Darkness has re-emerged. Well, Soul Blazer was also very linear, too. It was pretty much, you go to a town, you revive the town, and then you move on to the next town by doing dungeons. And killing all the monsters in the area. Cool. Which game was it with those two uh, vampires that took me hours to beat? Was that Illusions of Gaia in the underwater area? That's when the dungeons got a little bit more complicated. Okay, where do I go now? Oh my god, we're up in the mountains. Yeah, they're like low-key saying this is Illusions of Gaia 2, but there's a reference of Soul Blair Blazer and Illusions of Gaia 1, so they're pretty it's pretty much a trilogy. Where is this guy? Top left, okay, thanks. In the meantime... Starstones lay at the grave of time's end calls the golden child. Oh no. Holy cow. I'm gonna have to watch one of those YouTube videos that explain the story of the game.
Go away, snowman. <laughs> hey, it's a shop. We need to stock up. Monk robe? Oh, that sucks. This shop sucks. Hey, Vess, did you see the Monkey Island announcement? Yeah, someone told me in the chat. I think that's cool, man. I think that's cool. Okay, we're looking for star stones. Interesting. So I'm assuming all the towns have changed. so far away. I need Jaeger, man. I'm so lost now. We have so many side quests still and and all this other shit. Star Stones all over the world hidden in side quests? Oh god, dude. Ugh. Yeah, Wukong. Wukong's sick. Is there anyone I still need to talk to in this town? He's busy moving some furniture in his new house, but he said he's coming back soon. Dude, that's gonna be me moving furniture pretty soon. I'm super hyped. Check out Tokyo. Dude, I need to get to my boat. Oh, there's a stupid desert. Hey, maybe I can talk to the girl that can't talk here. Well, they told you the Superstore story? That's hilarious. <clears throat> yeah, I was I was joking, like, because Willie was pissed off about it. And I was like, yeah, she's probably telling all her friends the work, the story. And she's like, you know what I said to him? <laughs> I'm in a hurry. And then all the other, her and all the other ladies are like, <laughs> and that pissed off when I told him that story. I totally, I guarantee a thousand percent she said that to her co workers. I usually just open bags and let me die. What would you say, Zach, in that situation? Oh, she went back. People who claimed to be her parents came for her. Oh, man. Okay, 
Yeah, so she's gone. No, like, dude, trust me. If you were there in that setting, that lady was so rude. Like, <laughs> you just can't do that shit, man. She was so oblivious on how long she was talking to, to that customer. She was holding up the entire line, dude. It was so fucking rude. If I was in a bad mood, I would have definitely asked to talk to the manager. For sure. I think Willie was being more than polite. Willie was being overly polite. If we grabbed her stuff and went to the other line, she wouldn't have noticed. That's how zoned out she was. No, 30 minutes is an exaggeration, but it was a long time. I would say it was like a good, like, six, seven minutes of straight talking. I would have definitely called the manager, though. If I was in a bad mood. But like, like I said, I was talking to Willie about it, because Willie was pissed off. I'm like, dude, like, you're never going to see this lady ever again your entire life. Like, we could have been spiteful, and yeah, she was doing a shit job, but, like, what would we gain from it, right? It's just a waste of our mental energy. We just say, excuse me, get her to do her fucking job, grab her groceries, go home, and move on with our lives, you know? You can't, you gotta learn to pick your battles, you know what I'm saying? You can't just fight every single person that pisses you off. If there's something that affects your life every day, that you have to deal with, then that's the kind of battle you want to fight, right? Not something you're never going to deal with again. Oh my god, I'm so lost here. I don't know how I'm going to get to a boat. I think down here is one of the things, though. So, Jaeger's moving furniture. I got no one to help me. Oh, finally, a boat. All right. Where should we go first? Go to China first? You said the mute girls in China though. Dude, I'm not gonna get- no one's gonna be touching my fucking computer, Zach, if that's what you're saying. Are you fucking kidding me? No, me and Willie, we're going on a- We're going on a mission where we're not- we're gonna literally go with our computers and Willie's car. And we're not gonna drive until it's like 4 or 5 in the morning. When there's zero traffic, and then that's how we're gonna get it there. We already have it all planned out, dude. The movers are just gonna move shit that doesn't really matter. Just like the big furniture, that's all. Yeah, of course, I mean... Yeah, I'm not gonna have some mover lift up my computer tower, no fucking way. The, the, the video card alone in my tower is so fucking expensive and valuable. There's no way I would chance it.
You missed a lot. We went to... Uh, we First we went to the town, Jaeger, where there was like a cult. Then we learned about the big bad guy. Then we went to a laboratory dungeon. Killed a bunch of robots, and then we learned about how there used to be a world that died from a disease. Only a certain amount lived. And then we apparently died, and now we're back. Now I don't know what to do. And we have a million side quests, and we're supposed to look for these star stones. Is the Forest series being announced this year? Yeah, probably sometime in September. Here's a fortune teller. What you seek are in a dream, sand, ice, mountain, and ruins. Okay, so everywhere. What I seek is everywhere. Thanks. Is this magic shop good? Sky ring costs three. Brass pin costs four. Water pin costs six. So the strongest magic is is boom ring. Screw magic. Let's grab one of these boom rings. Like, look how many magic rocks I have. Let's grab like three of these. Okay, I want to talk to those parents first for finding that mute girl. The dragon spear. Yay, we got bulbs. Oh, wow, these weapons suck. Don't waste money, you need 5,000. I got more than 5,000. I need to buy those healing items. I don't know, this guy already told me this. Okay, so after I talk to these parents, Jaeger, I should go to back to Russia. I need to pay some dude. All right, I'll make sure I not I don't spend more than five thousand. Hey, there's magic rock here I never grabbed. Uh oh. Oh, there she is. This blue stone. Thank you. I want the star stone though. <gasps> hey, she talked. Thank you. Jaeger, I have a million side quests. Save me. Save me. Okay, you say go to Russia? Should I just grab the plane?
Okay, one guy's telling me to go to Russia, the other is telling me to go to Japan. Where do I go? Neo Tokyo. All of them. Dude, my eyes. Dude, I just want to finish this game so badly, dude. So badly. So we can play Kino tomorrow. I want to play Kino. Everyone's gone. <laughs> Excuse me. It was the only one that wouldn't open before. Fighter's Destiny? What am I looking for? The police! What is that sound? The desk in the corner. Desk in the corner? In this room? Transceiver. Interesting. I understand now you're interesting. Someone help. There's someone alive. Uh-oh. Come help. <laughs> oh, she's supposed to say over. What sound behind her voice? The sound of flowing water. So that means... <gasps> Holy cow. How's a kid supposed to play this game? What did you miss? A lot. I just checked the suggestion suggestion list. It should be renamed the Etra channel. The problem is, is a lot of the suggestions Etra does is not even actual games. It's like shovelware. And unlicensed knockoffs. Yeah. And like every game before even reading the name, I see like a suspiciously young looking anime girl riding on a fucking broomstick. Okay. 
Okay, how do I get to the sewers? Is there a man- uh... A manhole cover somewhere here? Go back to the closed door. I thought you said I needed a key for it. Wait, why is it open now? How did I get the key for it? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Seriously, why the fuck was I able to open that door? I think the key was just a... Oh, God, dude. The key was in your heart. Once again, Vesper ignores my real suggestions in favor of hyper-focus on the bad ones I make. Just to keep the narrative, each one has bad taste in games. Itra, I don't know how else to tell you this, bro, but it's not a narrative. <laughs> and I'm not the only one saying this. Anyone could go in that suggestion box and see for themselves and make their own judgment. My controls are completely fucked. Oh. Oh god. Ugh. Which way is up? Oh no. Right, good thing leaving the screen helps. You guys remember that fight? In Naruto, where that- where's that- that dude, like, Orochimaru's right-hand man, what was his name? Like, Kabuto or some shit? Yeah, Kabuto? Remember when he has to fight Tsunade, and she, like, fucked up his nerves? So every, all of his nerves controlled a different, like, muscle? And he, like, starts, like, rehabilitating himself on the fly? And all of a sudden, he just- like, he does this literally within, like, a, WHAT THE FUCK?! Okay, we're cursed. How do we stop this shit? Holy water? Holy shit, you will literally die in 10 seconds if you don't get use holy water? That item is so fucking important. Own up to it. I gotta finish this game tonight, Qua. You can own up to these nuts. Yeah, like, he completely rehabilitates himself, and the craziest part, too, is he, like, <laughs> he grabs his kunai, and he spins around at one end, and he's like, DON'T UNDERESTIMATE ME! And I was, like, watching this as a kid, and I'm like, HOLY SHIT! You know what I mean? He's cracked, right? I don't know, it was just such a crazy scene. And when my controls get fucked up, for some reason, I think about that scene. You know, imagine trying to blink in one eye and all of a sudden, like, your left index finger moves or something, you know? <laughs> it's just so... it's just so hardcore. Do these guys have machine guns? What the hell's going on? Am I playing the same game? never to use that move again. Yeah, that happens.
No cows. Shriek. <gasps> Sewer key. Hey, there's the key, guys. We found it. And I'm gonna do a big backtrack. My PC shot off on me as I was making my response to Vesper. Probably for the better. Dude, we have almost like $10,000. Wait, why do those enemies just run away? Oh my god. Whoa, why does this guy drop so much money? He stole cash. Wow, you see how much money he gave me? This is like the money farming spot. Hey, it's the girl. It's coming. There's no lion. Holy shit, it's a lion. The hell? Hopefully that lion is that my lion buddy from back then. Remember when we climbed up that mountain? Where the fuck am I now? What was his name? It was like, uh, I don't know. I think it was Simba. Dude, remember when we beat Lion King on Genesis? Holy fuck. That game. Oh no! Shit's going down in 10 seconds. At least the enemies drop holy water. Oh god, kid chameleon, holy fuck. Kid chameleon. Did you know they... F they made three more of those games? 
Holy, and they're all the fucking same. Wait, what did I get just now? What was in that chest? Oh yeah, holy water. What's this, Quan? Etrod wrote something, but I didn't get a chance to read it. Something about being whack. Oh, Echo Jr. and Echo for Dreamcast. That is unfinished business. I don't know, Claw. If that game is longer than like one hour, <laughs> dude, I'm not gonna like throw away my time of playing awesome games for Echo Jr. or Echo on Dreamcast before Street Fighter 6. It's definitely gonna be a week long. Cool, I remember when you were hyped to play Echo 2 and the look of enjoyment on your face turned into grief. I'll never forget the look on your face when you played that area where you were flying in the air through that tube. It was like, I've never seen you so miserable. The last time I've seen you that miserable was when you played uh, Death Stranding. That's the last time I've ever seen that look on your face. <laughs> Yo, you wanna play? <laughs> I turn to my right, look at Killy. He's sleeping. Nuh uh. I'm good. <laughs> Where's my next armor upgrade, Jaeger? I need armor. Oh my god, who's this? What the hell? It's that green mech theme from Mega Man X. I need to know where armor is. Hey, armor. What? I was supposed to buy the armor? No, I saw what Claw said. I wasn't too busy talking about free-to-play. I told him about- No, you didn't, Yager. Stop making stuff up. That's the path of Etrot. The truth will set you free. It's all registered in the VOD, I fear nothing. Yeah, Etra thought that'd save him too, Jaeger. You underestimate. Please, don't eat me! Grr! Come on then! Battle Master Arc is your blind date. Uh-oh. Grr. Grr? Grr. I got it. Don't recall seeing this line? Take a good close gander now. I already know who it is. It's Simba. Uh, it's Lim. The cub. It's been a long time. Wait, I thought I couldn't talk to him. 
I can't understand animals anymore. Why can't I understand animals anymore, Kwong? I don't understand why I can't understand animals. And what is he doing in Tokyo? What the hell's going on? It's deep, I guess. Human bad, animal good. Because humans? An old friend of mine. A lion friend? That's neat. Your friend's an asshole. We got a star stone, let's go! Let's go! We got two of them now, don't we? We're the best. Side quest hell! Looking for a group! Yeah, we got one in advance. Thanks to our diligence and gamefacts.com. Freedom's research team. Alright. We're in the storage reservoir. Roar! Wait, how come he can understand me but I can't understand him? That makes no sense. Because it's deep? Why is there a line in Tokyo? By this by the spam of time? No way man, lions live for a long time. Like lobsters. Or was it crabs? Was it a lobster or a crab that are literally immortal? I think lobsters are immortal. I'm pretty sure. The jellyfish is also immortal? Interesting. Is there anything else I was missing in this area? No, I did room research in it. Jellyfish have no lifespan. Still think a lobster is a little bit more interesting because it's a little bit more sentient than a jellyfish, probably. Yeah, I got the painting, Jaeger. Ouch. Damn it! Another conspiracy theory I have about Vesper, any games that suggest that I don't like, Vesper will play it and then like it for the sake of liking it. 
Also knows reverse psychology. You know what you try? You you do this really like analytical thinking, overthinking I would say on things. But it's strange that you've never come to the conclusion yet that maybe you have bad taste in games. Has that never gone through your head before? Jaeger says to go to West Russia, but Freedom says go to England. Either way, I'm going to go on the plane. Now, if my geography serves me right, I'm going to attempt to guess where England is. Prepare yourselves. I know England is in Europe. Did I go to that temple you just passed? I don't know. The one in the water? Zach, we just watched GoldenEye recently. It was fucking Kino. I was always better, James. <laughs> Who the fuck is it, Qua? Is there a, like a world map thing in this game? Right? It's on the left side of South America. Why didn't you just say so? Is that it right there? Freedom, I have no fucking clue where Chile is. I know there's a restaurant called Chili's. I don't know where Peru is. Oh no, I'm hypnotized. What the hell's going on? Jaeger, why don't you tell me about this? I was going to in due time. Uh oh, that's not good. We're off the path. Imagine being a kid just wandering around this game being completely lost at all times. Holy cow! It's my buddies. Wait, what? How dare you? I'm Malia. What the hell is going on? Spends a year without food or drink? Bring the wrong goblet means death?
What? Where do I go? Uh-huh. Hopefully I didn't drink the wrong one. I'll try pushing the statues, one sec. Oh! I found a secret. What is this? Puzzle God. Oh, you guys talked about before, yeah, yeah. But here's an actual puzzle. It's the same puzzle? Puzzle God, dude. Vesper, do you think this game would- Don't even fucking get me started, Cole. What did I order? I ordered a... A shake and a blizzard from Dairy Queen. And the driver got here in, in, an, in a ridiculously fast time. Oh no. Is this armor or weapons? What armor should I get rid of? Should I get rid of this bird suit? What about rags? Leaf suit? Okay. Keep the rags? Get, get rid of the leaf suit? Do you remember that Ninja Turtle shirt you kept? Those were rags. What? What the hell are you talking about? The one that was ripped to shreds? What the hell are you talking about, Claw? I have no fucking clue what you're talking about. <laughs> ripped to shreds? What the hell are you talking about? Okay, should I throw away this stupid leaf suit? Can I throw away this armor? No, I don't know what you're talking about, Claw, I swear. Okay, can I throw away clothes? You can throw away any armor. I don't know, Claw said not to throw away the rakes. <laughs> I'm gonna throw away this silver vest. The rags are sacred?
Notice how they have their own hanging spot. Well, there's these four ones in the center. I don't know what the hell that's about. Like Ellie's cape. I'm throwing away this bird suit too. It's stupid. Holy suit. Is it better than the king's suit? It sucks. What a waste of time. It's 15 it's 15 it's plus 15 suck. Three A's and a handprint. Can it suck? Ken's fucking crazy. Dude, somebody left a YouTube comment today that completely triggered me. In the Ken breakdown video, he said... He said, none of these changes matter. They did not address Ken's issues. What the fuck are you talking about? They literally buffed Ken getting in. <laughs> like, what's wrong with these people? What did you want? A, f a fucking machine gun? The Dolkin. <laughs> like, I, <laughs> I don't understand. Oh my god, it's the crew. Or is it? Unbelievable. That's the guy who killed that guy, uh, Mr. Wong, because he killed his best friend. You chose the correct goblet. Wait, why did she drink the goblet? Why is she still alive? What is going on? I need a YouTube video that explains the whole story in this game. Superhuman. Even the video will be like, for some reason, these guys are here. Oh my god. What the hell is going on with this game? Who wrote this shit? Oh no. Living in misery. Kojima. <laughs> I'm going to make you a god of death. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, what? Holy shit, there's a romance side story? Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Holy cow, that escalated quickly. What animals can love? What the hell? <laughs> yeah, those goats, right? Exactly. She loved him so much she ate him. Uh-oh. 
I don't know. Should I equip that armor so I have 15 more luck? What the hell was that entire thing about? Like, what was the purpose of that whole thing, guys? Holy shit. Okay, so, did what I see, like... <laughs> did that happen, or...? Who knows? That's up to my interpretation. Guys, this game is getting heavy. Okay. Now we have to find England. Did you miss Earthrun Gym 2? Uh, no. You're never gonna miss it, actually. It'd be impossible to miss. No! <laughs> I love how you understood what I meant, like, immediately. No! <laughs> like, you immediately understood. That's great. <laughs> no! I don't know, maybe if you keep reminding me, maybe we'll check it out sometime. I mean, it is technically on the list. Earthrun Gym was pretty fun, it's a fucking hard game though. I didn't cut it, it's more like... We, after this game, we have no more time, because of Street Fighter 6. So we're going to break the rules for the rest of the year. The second one's better? Okay, maybe then I, I might check it out, bro. If, if you're hyping it up that much. Because the first one was enjoyable, it was just hard. Okay, guys. It's geography time. So I think England is right about... Uh, here. This is England, right? How do I land? Uh, do I land here? Should I land on this strip? Or do I keep looking? Chat requesting assistance. I need answers. I don't give a fuck if England's an island. Do I land here? That is my question. I need a boat? Shit. Look for the island first, west side? Okay. So there's no strip that's close, hey? Alright, I'll go grab the boat. That was a fun cruise.
Mm-mm. Vesper doesn't know what Archie Lego is. Didn't we talk about that before, Jaeger, when you tried to explain where Japan was? Yeah. Not geography classes, Vesper. Uh, not any class, Shred. Okay, do I go northeast or do I go to this town here? We don't go to this dock yet? Okay. I'm looking for the Archie uh, Lego. Right here? It's a giant mansion. Mm -hmm. I am <laughs> I am rich, if I do say so. I am super rich. I wish to decorate, but I can't find a thing worthwhile. Money is no object, as I said. I am super rich. Okay, bro. Let's rip this guy off. What is that painting? It is fantastic. I want it. I care not about the price. Is that so? I will hand it right away. Wow, he gave me a thousand... What a ripoff! I gotta tell him myself? This asshole won't... What do you got over here? Hmm. He is a shrewd judge. Hmm. What was that sound? Okay, now what? Where do I go now? Where do we go now? Sahara? Uh, Sahara. That is over here. Hey, I found something. What the hell? Wow, that was a huge... They'll go anywhere if they can smell money. What the hell? How are you supposed to figure this out? Well, I guess the fortune teller lady said one was in the desert. <coughs> yeah, she said it was everywhere. Snow, mountain, desert, everywhere.
There's another spot right by the mountains on the top left. Right, but wait, what? Holy shit, more money. Is that it? I like how they expect you to like literally search every single tile. There's another one. Oh god. Oh my god, how are you supposed to figure that out? You have nothing but time. Now go to the oasis. Hey look, it's a camel. He's drinking. The hell he didn't sell me anything. Holy cow. Wait, why do these guys need to have a torch in the desert? Wouldn't they be really warm already? Why is no one selling anything? It's not nighttime though, guys. Does this look like nighttime to you guys? How do I buy off this guy? It keeps saying you. Wa I want to have a look. It doesn't show me shit. What the fuck? Call. I talked to this guy three times. What the hell? How many do I buy off of him? One crystal. Okay. Oh. Oh. I wish I could stretch my limbs like Dalsum. Do you guys remember Dalsum Yoga Tower? How stupid that move was? That's racist, Jaeger. But I know where you're talking about. Is the dog? Oh, it's right here. God, man. Oh, God. Sun Coast. You guys remember the guy who made the telephone? And then his girlfriend was cheating on him. 
with the guy that was like, Rrgh. There's a forest on the lower left side. Can't be this one. Isn't this right at the start of the game? Watch, one of these vines leads to a dead end, the other one's... Jump to drop. You can't jump to drop. Why doesn't he use his legs to climb again? Skips leg thing. <laughs> Imagine going up the left side. Did you not just see what happened, Qua? <laughs> now go to the mountain. Who the hell is this? That's man. I am a scientist. <clears throat> this place is the least polluted when Earth is ang endangered like now. Or did it say anger? Let me see what he said. Okay, let's listen to this guy. This guy sure listens to a lot of voices. Find a ranch. Coconut juice? Wow. He's snoring. Wait, I can take a picture of this place. Wait, what? No, fuck your forecast. I think my beep is the best in the world. 
Can you advertise it? Okay. A single bite is worth a thousand words. Tasty meat. Do I have to go to the burger guy? Man, all these cows are grass fed. Okay, where do I go? Where to next? Let's beat this game! Let's beat this game! China? Oh god, here we go again. Yo, what's up, Luca? How's the pressure? What am I playing tomorrow? I'm either gonna play Resident Evil 1 Remake or Mario 64. <laughs> Enter the hallway. Between the inn and the other house. And into the first house you see on the right. I vote remake, keep the memory in the brain. Memory in the brain is good, Funky. That's a good idea. Yeah, I did the side quest with the mute girl. But we didn't get anything from that. All we got was a Magi Rock Ye Jaeger. We didn't get shit. Mm -hmm. Okay, but that side quest sucks ass. Finally finish the series so we can get to Resident Evil 4. Yes. I can go to Spain now? Where is Spain? Remember England? I'll never forget for the rest of my life. It's by the... The, the Chilego. You guys want to see me play Resident Evil 6? I don't know, guys. That doesn't sound like a good idea at all. I thought we were supposed to play good games. <sighs> Resident Evil 6 we have to see? Oh god. Okay, here's England. Where's Spain? You passed it. We played Maximum Garbage, didn't we? Yes, we did. I think there's a Maximum Garbage too.
Huh? Here? What? Who's this? First, they're all brown houses. What the hell are you talking about? Oh, never mind. Technically, it's golden. Oh no. Rare mineral. Oh no. That's sparkly still. I'm generous. What is he gonna make out of this? Maximum garbage sequels two players. Oh god. I'm so traumatized by the death and return of Superman. They have so many fetch quests in this area. Wait, hold on. I want to see what he says if I don't have it in my hand. Sardines are plentiful, but they rot quickly. I wonder if there's a way of preserving them for a long time. There's no way a kid will figure this out. To, to give him a tin sheet for preserving sardines? Jesus Christ. Oh. It's lower than garbage? That's pretty low. It's worse than Kid Chameleon? Tin sardines. Why do- What's- What's so good about tin for preserving food? Like, why not preserve it in glass? Jaeger's not answering my historical questions. His head shaking. Because it repels germs or something, I don't know. No, it doesn't. Find the store? Hey, it's the guy. You mean the ring mail? The other one? The other what? What the hell are you talking about? The silver vest? Don't I already have a silver vest? I 
I did have one, but I threw it away, I'm pretty sure. When I was asking you guys what armor to throw away. Okay, so buy a silver vest, yes? Then go back to your boat. How am I you're supposed to know about this silver vest side quest? Check how many star stones I have. Should have three, I think. Five. I was close. I now have five star stones. You have them already. Well, what about the fucking armor? Oh, Bunky is gonna tell me through Google search. Vesper. Tin is a non-reactive metal, so the food sealed inside stays protected from things like oxygen, light, bacteria. But what about glass? Why not use glass? Tin is more effective... Oh, God. Glass is not a no Glass is not even metal. Thanks, Jaeger. I didn't know that. Dude! When you buy fucking containers for storing food, you buy glass containers. You don't buy tin containers. They're all glass or plastic. Are you asking for material to preserve food? I'm asking, what is the big deal about tin? What makes tin so special for preserving food as opposed to using glass? That's all I'm saying. Or plastic. Why is it such a breakthrough? Okay, where am I going? It's cheaper than glass? Plastics are bad for you. <laughs> Dude, okay. So you guys are saying that um Like you know you buy like, you know, sardines is a good example, but you buy like tuna fish. They're all in tin cans. Right? That's cheaper than having them all in glass cans. What about uh like aluminum, like we have, we store pop. Why isn't pop stored in tin? Glass or plastic can't protect from deterioration caused by light. Really? I didn't know tin was so special. That's very interesting. I did not know tin was so special. I thought tin was just because it's cheap. I didn't know it actually had, like, uh, benefits for storing food. This game teaches you things, that's why it's gold. That's right, Qua, I found out where England is. Plastic releases bad shit on food after a while. Iron containers would eventually spoil. Pop does come in tin cans. What kind of pop? Isn't it aluminum? I, I didn't know. Pop cans aren't tin, are they? We're gonna get to the bottom of this tin can shit, guys. Next Street Fighter stream, we're gonna go into more detail on this. Plastic can definitely be dangerous if you throw it in the microwave.
Did you see how crazy this town evolved, Jaeger? Look at it now. It's insane. Look how big the town is now. Luck boosts the chance of critical hits. That's crazy. That guy's sleeping on the job. Hey, there's the guy again. Whoa, this soul armor is almost as good as my current armor. Whoa, what's this? Five thousand gems for a bird. Oh wait, isn't that that animal? That what's his name was talking about? Do I buy it anyways? Or go do your side quest first. Should I buy it now? You're so kind. Dun, 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 dun. This RPG. This isn't an RPG. This is a village simulator game. This is SimCity 2000. Is SimCity 2000 Jaeger is when they take it to the next level and you gotta build a sewer system? That's when the game takes a dark turn. A super dark turn. Dude, every time we talk about SimCity, I still get salty over the original SimCity and how much of a joke it is. I think Qua was the one that, that showed me the truth of how stupid that game was. Where you have to... Where roads are bad, no matter what. Like, you should never build roads. That pisses me off. Uh, you don't need to fund the fire department. That also pisses me off. And it doesn't matter how far uh, the industrial zone is from your houses. What I mean is, like, people don't care how far they have to drive to work. And you literally just build police departments by the industrial zone. That entire game is about pollution and crime rate. Which doesn't make any sense. Why would there be a bunch of fucking criminals near the factories? If there's no roads, you can't drive to work anyways. Yeah, but you just build railroad tracks. Like, the whole game is so... Oh, it just pissed me off. You're so limited on what... Because there's a, there's a min-max way to play the game. And once you realize that min-max way, it ruins the game for you. Aluminum is a great conductor, so it cools faster. Aluminum doesn't rust. Very recyclable and easily manufactured. It covers a lot of uses. I knew about the conductor part. So that pop stays really cold. But I still did not know that tin was so valuable. I never touched the game and I don't plan to. Don't. I just cut back the funding from transportation to instantly win. Oh god.
Wait, what was I doing again? Oh yeah, I was exploring this place. What? I've been taking non-stop photos! How do I not have enough information? Where's that town? Wait, what the hell happened to the town? Where's the trees? It looks like fucking Ogremar. The shack caught fire. The wind whipped the fire up. The village went up in flames. Holy cow! See, this is what happens when you don't invest in the fire department. My... My corn. Oh. Oh my god. This sucks ass. What about the hamburger guy? Everything gone. I can't even cook. Oh no. What do you mean disappear from the world? There's nothing left. I was wondering why the town was just like, you know, just empty land. What's the economic value of this area? How the hell is it 10%? This guy sucks at his job. Wow, this guy's the only house that remained? Uh-oh. More tin education. Vesper. Tin is also lightweight, while being durable. So it's hard to break by accident, lasts longer than aluminum for shelf life. They also have the advantage of chilling fast, so hot temperatures become less of a problem with them. It does not react with food, so no matter how much time passes, there is no impurities in it. And the top it off, tin is recyclable and does not corrode in water. So why don't they use tin for pop cans then, if it's superior to aluminum? My corn. Tin is Luke tier. What do you mean avoiding the dude? Nine letters. Please give these people, give these to people you meet. Oh my God. Oh no, they're starting to go fund me. Uh oh. Oh no, mighty number nine. We gotta talk to nine different people. Oh God. If you want to pay $10 per can of pop, sure. What are you talking about? We just discussed how tin is cheap.
We just discussed this shit. Otherwise, they would store sardines in aluminum instead of tin if it was out, if it was cheaper. You know what spam is, right? The food? Yes, I'm aware of spam. Why not just drink your pop from pure gold goblet at that point? Okay, so I don't know what's with your extreme str <laughs> straw man attempt. We're comparing tin to aluminum here. Okay. <laughs> Are spam sandwiches big in Canada? Mm, I don't know. Tuna and sardines are in aluminum and steel cans, not tin. Tin is a rare metal. Are you fucking kidding me? That can't be true. We just discussed how the game literally represented this as using tin. Specifically for sardines. And the entire point of the conversation was... Why did they not put sardines in aluminum? Now you're telling me it's in aluminum. What's pop? You mean soda? Oh my god, guys. You guys say I'm the one who's uneducated. I'll go help rebuild the town whenever I can. gonna tell all of his friends okay now what the short answer why soda cans use aluminum instead of tin is because most of the chemicals present in food aren't present in sodas so the balance shifts to the cheaper metal of the two thanks azradi that was a good response now, I need to know if sardines... I need to know if the majority of sardine cans are made from aluminum or tin. Once you answer that question, I can sleep. And our journey finally ends. Who am I talking to? It's in this area. <laughs> okay. It's in this area. Got it. Hey look, this guy's playing games. I love TV. It's the greatest. It was the greatest. Nah, oh, it's ass.
Did I give- did I give him a letter? Yeah, I did. Seven left. I can't believe they expect you to literally just talk to everyone with these letters. Like, holy shit, dude. This game is ridiculous. You'd be stuck in this game for the rest of your life. Yo, what's up, DMC? Oh my god, another one taking the letter? Oh yeah, that's the guy! <laughs> my ex-girlfriend lives there! That's awesome! Yep. Uh. Yeah, DMC, we were discussing the difference between aluminum and tin. Tin is a rare material. Oh no. Oh, that's the girl. Holy cow. Look for the dude that wants meat. Got it. Huh? But I need to hear the story first, Jake. I need to know the hint on if they want meat or not. Oh! Bring me food that delights me and I'll reward you. There you go, yeah, you see? Tasty meat. Sun Coast, huh? He's entering ketosis. Oops, what do you say? The aroma is also not unpleasant. My vote of confidence. This will become popular. A hundred gems! I like how they say burgers are gourmet. Check if you can give them the letter. He just wants hamburger. Let me talk to the Monopoly man. Wow, that's the bartender? That's crazy. Am I going by Boulder playing?
There are no airports in Antarctica, really? Wait a second. Where is Antarctica? Is it down here? Gotta find a dock. Whoa, do I go to this cave? Or here? Why at the extreme edge of the world? Whoa. Go to the cave first? Okay. Oh my god, this is annoying. Hey, it goes on one of those things. It's a downgrade. they're even being a pit there. Okay, so I'm going here. Do I have to equip the star stones? What was the hint that you had to go here with the star stones? Did it say to go to the end of the world? Oh, we need one more. Oh, never mind, I had six. I'm the legendary hero. Wait, what?
That's not true at all. No, it's not Quap. Have you ever met yourself? No, you haven't. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> You're so full of shit. This story is so off the rails. Chapter 4? Holy shit, I forgot there even was chapters in this game. Only four chapters left? No fucking way. If there's seriously four chapters left, we're flush in this game. Secret of Mana, yeah, it's one of my favorite games. It's a banger. It's a Haruki banger. Yo, Alex Grant, man. Thanks for the seven months, bro. Thanks, buddy. What the hell is going on? What the hell? Oh my god. Oh no, leave me alone. What is going on? Holy cow. I will explain everything after. Please do. Oh no, the first time they've confronted each other. The light side and the dark side. Oh no, this is what happened to Kwan when he saw his twin.
Oh no. Whoa! Who the hell is Kumari? Is that the Buddha guy in the mountains? Who the hell is Ra? Oh yeah, the tree at the very beginning. Right, the one that I got OCD because I found I could open those things. Liam, is that the... that's Simba, right? I thought they couldn't animals couldn't talk to me. Wait, what happened to that bird I bought for five thousand gems? Is the wind going to start talking to me? What the hell's going on? Do I understand yet? No? I don't know what the hell's going on. Wait, how did I grow old? I'm Ed? Oh, I wouldn't watch this, Mir. <laughs> this game is pro-capitalism. I'm not very smart, but I love my village. What? What is going on? Who's talking right now? Mm -hmm. Yomi's talking. Okay, hold on. Yomi's talking. Oh my god. This is getting deep. She's in shock. Oh, no. 
Oh yeah, we come from underground. Should've known Yomi was a piece of shit this whole time. Ark, you still don't understand, do you? You were just used, Ark. You're just a piece in a game. Can I fight this stupid piece of shit? Does this mean I can't access my inventory anymore? <laughs> oh no! What happened to Micah's name? He's having a midlife crisis like, uh... Like, uh, Matsuda. What can she even do? I don't know how she did this either, but it's deep. <laughs> ah. Ali did nothing wrong. If I didn't open Pandora's, Pandora's box, I don't think so, bro. He's finally realizing this now. <laughs> Underworld Ellie or Surface Ellie? <laughs> Holy fuck, she was carefully. That was a go- <laughs> We need to betray Underworld Ellie. Ellie did nothing wrong. the hero story again. Yo, what's up, Beatles? We're trying to finish this game once and for all so we can do No Limit Retro.
Poor Columbus, bro. Kill him! That was Yomi from inside. Oh no, it's the other Yomi. Okay. I can't tell the difference. <laughs> Wait, what if we don't have an inventory space? Then what happens? Best in slot? Whoa! Go to the town close to Spain. I know where that is. <laughs> wow, we're back in the main village? Oh no. Siberia. Oh no. Oh shit, it's Fida. Oh no, it's Roy, he's back to avenge his best friend that we never met. The skateboard wizard? Oh no. so much damage we did to that guy? Wait, which way do I go? <laughs> Teleporter pin? I don't think I have one. Remember this area is huge too, isn't it? This is that giant maze area.
No. Is a teleporter a specific pin? This area is massive. It's crazy. Well, it's too late now. We've gone through like half the area. I can't believe like they expect you to go through this whole area all over again. It's the bone pin? Yeah, I think I got one of them. out of here. Hopefully. Don't tell me you have to figure out the maze backwards. Oh, thank God. That area is the biggest area in the entire game. That's crazy. Alright, where do we go next? Okay, where are we? We need to get on a boat. You have to go here? See if I have it equipped. Oh, there we go. Gonna support me so much I can paint as much as I want. So pretty much all the people that have uh, quest chains can see the letter in this game, pretty much. I think that in itself is is uh, a quest to make sure that you run into all the people that give you quests. That's pretty much what that quest is. Now where are we going? Where? What place?
Go back to the same town? Holy cow, it's huge now. <laughs> Imagine voting for the other dude. The communist guy? <laughs> I'm not very smart, but I love my village. I think everyone should have the money. So if you if you vote for the other guy, you basically screwed up your entire file. And the town will never grow. Oh, we're looking for a house. We have apartments open for 800 gems. Wow, I wish buying a house was that simple and quick and easy. Alright, here's your key. <laughs> I want to buy a house. Okay. Who's Gene? Hey, this is the mayor's house. What happened to the guy that wasn't smart? Or did I just talk to him? Oops. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's the guy right here. That guy, if we voted for him, it would have been a disaster. Oh wow, we can decide our furniture? That's so cool. Do we want this wooden table? Wow, I'm getting upsold? Awesome! This is crazy! Wow, you can buy all this furniture? <laughs> hey, close. Wow, we're like an IKEA right now. Oh, we got rugs. Man, everything's the same price. That's convenient. TV? Can we buy a TV? Nothing else I can buy? Damn it! Now what? Where's my house? I got tired of hard liquor. What the hell? Town destroyed by a fire. That's terrible. 
Now what? Oh, really? All those little kids? <laughs> Wait, these are the kids right here! What the hell? They made their, their own business? Holy shit. Nice suit! Wow, this armor sucks. This. Holy cow, it's already 11 o'clock. How do we not finish this game? I can't believe how much, like, how far they went with the towns and the evolution of the towns. Like, it's a mechanic that the Quintet games had, but they went so far in this game with it. It's pretty nuts. This game is eternal. KOF 15 is eternal, Kev. That game is eternal. Now I'll go back to the tin dude. I don't even know where he is. Can I take a picture of this place? Chaos is eternally messed up on PC. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, my friend. Where's the tin guy? What's the point of the economy, guys? Is he just letting you know, like... I gotta give away the, the tin sardine first, I guess. Now what? I have to go back to freedom? Oh my god, are you serious? Cheeks. Oh yeah, the soft block. You know, we're playing <laughs> Crusader of Senti or whatever. You're gonna get soft locked. Okay, now who wants the sardines? 
Where is he? Sardine man. Where art thou? The house on the right. There are many houses on the right. The shop house? shops He did tell me about the soft block eventually This game is underrated. I just think that since it wasn't released in the US, nobody played it. Yeah, where the hell is this? Like, where am I talking to? The dude I gave the meat to? Yeah? Was he in the other area? Is there another area? Tickets. Hey, who's this guy? Jazz Hotel. We haven't saved in a long time. A very long time. We haven't saved in like four hours. So let's do that. Oh my god, where is this fucking clown, Jaeger? I got here. Sleeping man. Where did that animal go? <laughs> He's free now. Now the guy with the grinded meat is not in freedom. He's in the burnt down village. Oh, 
Oh! Can I talk to this guy? Is this in the guy? Tin sardines. Tinned? I don't know that cooking method. Yeah, 100 gems. So I need to rebuild the village in order to give that guy the meat patty? Where's my house that I built, Jaeger? I want to see my house. Where's my house? Hey, that's the guy that told us about the treasure. That's crazy. Hey, it's a letter. Getting many orders for the tin sardines. No, it's still the same. S. Soft lock confirmed. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, the rich man. Riches. Riches the rich man. Hey, here's the painting he, he hanged up. That's awesome. I am super rich for justice. That's amazing. The picture is an act razor reference. It looks like Yori. The one in the other room? 
I don't know about that. I don't know what you're talking about, Jaeger. All I know is Act Razor 2 was hell. I played that game on the hardest side and it was the worst. That's it for the letters? Some dude said go hardest and left after 20 minutes. I think it was like 5 minutes, Paul. Like, he, I played the first level and I died, the guy's like, oh shit, and then he left. Whoa, they rebuilt it already? Raised from the ashes. Wow. It looks way better than it did before. They don't have a farm anymore, though. Damn. That's insane. That story will have anyone howling. That guy's an asshole. I still have a million key items and I don't know what to do with them. <laughs> he is that guy. Hey, Illinois, that's crazy. What's the point of going here? Wow, it all sucks. Well, you said I have best in slot. Now what? Can we beat this game? Go to McDonald's? Spoilers! Holy shit! McBurger! I'm Mick, the Master Chef. He's gonna want that gourmet burger. Wow! Holy shit, copyright infringement. Look, it's the Hamburglar. Stop eating. <laughs> what the fuck? I lost a bet, so I have to ask you for a smile. <laughs> you guys remember that shit? Smiles are free. Oh my god, dude. I completely forgot about that. Holy shit. Except for a smile. Wow, they got pop. Wow. 
Grab a burger. Uh, would I like some fries? Sure, upsize them, please. Yeah, I'll take a pop, too. Wow. Thanks. You made this possible, Vesper. That's true. That makes me smile. Sure. But my, uh, my thumbnail for my controller video today also made me smile. It made me smile more. Why do I have to talk to Will again? Oh no. No! Oh god. No more! Jesus. The one with urine bar and Cammy and the Nerf hammer was also a smiley thumbnail. Yes, that one also made me laugh. I Google searched toy hammer and I found the perfect one. I knew as soon as I saw that hammer and I saw those Cami nerfs, I knew that was the one fit for the thumbnail. God. Now what? Now where am I going? Take the plane, thank God. <laughs> Excuse me, I don't know why I'm sneezing so much today. Oops, that's not the right button. Where is the landing strip? I'm never gonna play Elden Ring, Zach. I'll never play that game. But I will play Dark Souls 1. Missing out on your favorite game, Vesper. Guys, there's no way I'm going to waste my time that many hours on one single game. No fucking way. Have I been here before? Block rod? Wow, this weapon sucks! Wait, that's not the block rod. Wow, this weapon sucks! You already spend way longer than it would take to finish Elden Ring on Street Fighter 5. Yeah, except Street Fighter 5 grows my channel. Elden Ring does not. What the hell am I looking for? Oh, that's everything? Oh. I thought you, when you said go all the way right, I thought you meant within the cave. Hmm. 
So grabbing the the hero weapon was that a necessary quest? Like, did I have to do that to get that armor, or can I skip that? He is doing abominable work. Oh no, he's not the true guy. This is hardcore. Is this the final dungeon? So how do you grow the towns, Jaeger, besides the side quest? How else do the towns grow? So how did I get softlocked in that town then, when you said I couldn't grow it anymore, if I did the side quest? We probably missed something. Well, I still have the fever medicine. I still have a flower. We didn't do the tourist thing with the camera. We didn't talk to all the towns about the airfield plans. I didn't get to see my house yet. That I bought all that furniture for. There's a lot of things we didn't do. But I thought Neo Tokyo was destroyed. <laughs> oh, so if we go to this dungeon early, we can't get past this part with all our friends? Without all our friends? What the hell is taking so long? That chain ball, that's for that dungeon where we need, we need it for the water, remember? Where you told me to go all the way back to the starting for no reason? You just keep it? Well, what if you want to go back to that dungeon if you missed an item, right? What the hell is this? Ouch. How am I not dead? Roid? <laughs> So did we ever find out who the hell Roy's best friend was? <laughs> Where that dark story came from? Mr. Wong, you killed my best friend. <laughs> His best friend was Kojima. That's boogie. They're doing all these things that I can't see. 
Whoa. Spiral staircase. Level up. Twenty nine. Uh oh, don't say on three, please. Wow, we meet all of our friends from our adventure. spots <laughs> Damn, you guys can take more than a hit. south here we can go up this way so far it's pretty linear oh you can kill before you get damaged interesting I've been helping you like this. We never got to fight this guy or really anything. We kind of just talk to him every now and then and then all of a sudden he's like this big badass. It's really weird. <clears throat> Yo, what's up Gambit? We're finally finishing this game. How you been? I've been busy as fuck. I saw from your Twitter so you're focusing on your health and shit. Good idea. What? 
What switch? in here. controlling a, a switch. Okay, we gotta do I gotta do the last switch for them. Uh yeah probably Zach. I don't see why not. It might be good. Who's who's the writer? Don't tell me it's the clowns. No idea. Yeah, I'll check it out. Yeah, they're, they're they're good, Zach, when they actually have the writing written for them already. The fucking material. But when they have to write their own shit, they're not good. What does that say? It says you're not a good fucking writer. Do I just jump down? Oh, yeah, I do. Whoa. There's a machine called a computer. We have time bombs? We got time bombs. How'd you, how'd you get these? Who made them? Set us up the bomb. Whoa, there's turrets? Can I fight these guys? They only do one damage to me. No, I can't hit them. Well, oh, this dungeon's crazy. Ouch. on the south side. Where are the other computers? There's both these seven of them? There's an exit sign there. Hmm. What the hell? Where are the computers? Shit, I'm gonna get lost. I can't keep track of all this shit.
Oh, here's one. At least it's symmetrical. Yeah, so far two. Oh, good. Oh, nice. Two in one spot. Perfect. Wow, we gained a level already? These guys must give mad XP. circle? Yes, I did. And this should be the other balcony? Yeah. Okay, let's go back now. left. One more. Uno Moss. There's no reason to go up here? been up that ladder before. I'm not missing a ladder over here. circle on this already, but... Ship of the balcony. Oh no! Here we go, this is the last one. <laughs> yeah, that's all the bombs. Back of the ship, they said. I think that's where that runway was. We did not go here yet. Hey, your Street Fighter videos are helpful. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. We set up the bombs.
<laughs> oh no. It was part of his plan. Oh no. You are trapped by conventions. What? He's got jet shoes? Oh no, your stolen rocket belts? They're controlled by computer. Oh no. Played ourselves. Nani? Whoa, he got blended? Oh my god, the wind helped us? The greatest genius in history ends like that. Such is life. What? What kind of ending is that? What happened? His his boots malfunctioned or the propeller malfunctioned? No, he was clearly pushed by the wind. Oh my god, no! That's hardcore. They're just like, yo, you take it. What if I say no? Yo, what's up, Acid? You're up late? Yeah, we started this stream like over six hours ago. Super long stream tonight. Gotta get this game done. For Kino tomorrow. Oh no. Am I finally done this game? A nearby town? Are you kidding about the three chapters, Jaeger? I don't even have full health.
I don't know, man, dude. Even if I didn't have OCD, this game is absurdly long. Like, just talking to everyone in the towns and doing the side quests alone is in insanely long. And if you didn't have a guide, oh my god. You'd be playing this game for the rest of your life. Yeah, I'm telling you, bro. If there's actually three more chapters left, I'm flushing this. I'm, I'm not kidding. This is the last night I'm playing this game. It's way, way too long. Oh yeah, the north side house. Whoa, sea house. Red lobster? Smorgasbord? There's a magic rock here. The old man did nothing. Oh, the airplane? What? You can make places for flying machines to land with that? More people will be able to come here. Why is there a... What the hell? How do I get this rock? You don't? Really? Oops. Seriously? If you were a kid? You would think you would get that eventually. That would drive me crazy. How the hell do I get here? What the hell? Still drives you crazy? Yeah. I tried everything to get that off. Dude, I believe you. That sounds like a nightmare. I think I've been here already. Okay. 
wonder what the reception of this game would have been if it got released in the U.S. There's so much I want to say about this game. Where am I going? The port town? No, I'm pretty sure... Unless this was in the port town. Is there a tourism place in this small area? I don't think so. This is the one that didn't evolve, right? That we needed to evolve. Where's my apartment? That was my apartment? Oh, Litz wasn't taken. Oh my god, no, nothing was taken. Oh my god. I had to have the camera equipped? Oh, that explains it. Is this my house right here? Wait, why is someone living in my house? Oh, he has no hair. Wait, his sprite has hair though, what the hell? How do I know which apartment is one? Is this my house? Yeah, these apartments are pretty big. Yeah, where do I go now? See if the town has evolved? Not the tin dude again. Can we leave this guy alone? Oh no. We need to build airstrips everywhere. Wait, the airstrip tickets are gone. What the hell? There's only that many airstrips in the game? It should be everywhere. I've been getting orders upon orders for them. He's got his tin sardines.
No, it hasn't expanded yet. We're screwed. We're soft blocked. We're soft blocked, bro. Yeah, fuck this place. Why has it not evolved? What's missing? I'm talking to literally everyone. I mean, the town's really small. Yeah, I'm talking to literally everyone. Even this clown. There's no local industry. How's there not no local industry? There's sardines being sold. 100%! What the fuck? Maybe this town is expanded, but it doesn't physically change? how small this town is. Go back to the church guy? Doesn't say shit. Okay, we literally talked to everyone. Screw this area. Expanded. What the fuck? Capitalism works fast, dude. How long did it take that guy to sell his damn sardines? Damn, he's got an assistant now? Holy shit. This hospital's huge. Our 
people so busy they can't relax? What's the point of buying these, like, coffees and shit everywhere and all that? Like, what the hell is the point of that? Immersion? I was afraid you'd say that. What the fuck? Iron Man 3? Holy shit, this church is huge! Don't tell a teacher. Hey, that's me! That kid's me. Okay, what do I what do I need to do here? Nothing? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, now what? Where the hell is that? Australia. I think I know where Australia is. It still hasn't expanded? Oh, God. What now? Fuck these expanded cities. Did I not take a picture of this place? <laughs> the sun feels great. Yeah, I don't want to do that. 
If this game had was able to land the airplane in every place, maybe I'd do that, but fuck that. Let's get this game done. What is there even left to do? We that guy killed himself. I don't even know how he died. He was just like, and he ran to the blade for no reason. He's supposed to be the smartest guy in the world. It made zero sense. It was so dumb, Claw. They didn't build the airfield yet. Maybe they can't. Maybe Jaeger. Maybe they can't because of the stupid airfield. They haven't built it yet. Could have used a little tweaking. Yeah, especially since we don't even know how the hell the guy died. Oh no. Not the economist guy. Fuck. Where is this idiot? Who's this asshole? Alundra? Yeah, it's already on the list. In terms of RPGs. It's another really highly recommended one. Thanks. You're playing that right now, Claw? Interesting. Where the hell's the economy guy? Where is this idiot? Is this clown? How the hell are you supposed to know if the town has two screens? There he is. Okay, what's going on here? Sixty percent, it ain't shit. This, they need this airstrip in order to grow this town. Are you fucking kidding me? So now what, I gotta go to China? Wait, do I have the camera equipped? Who the fuck do I talk to? They're not saying shit to me, guys. Oh my god, dude. Holy cow, man. Yeah, this is annoying as fuck. Okay, where do I go? Let's beat this damn game. 
I don't know where I first came from. Was it was it South America? Brazil? Okay. How are you supposed to know to come back here? Where the hell- is that Columbus? How- how am I supposed to know Columbus has been here this whole time? Oh no. Oh my god, you'll never be able to come back. This is crazy. Is Qual gonna finally explain the whole damn story to me? Oh my god, my eyes. <laughs> Guys, I'm back home. I restored the entire surface. Where were you, man? What the hell's going on? What the hell? That's Ralph. Look, the pot's still boiling. Don't talk to anyone, but I want to know what they have to say. Like this guy. You have done well to return. We resurrected the world. Oh no. We know too much. This how does this elder know so much? And where did he go? Did he go to the basement? He's outside? Hold on, let me grab my shoes. Don't need to take a picture of this place. The flowing crystal blue. What? What 
What is this story? What the hell? What the fuck? What? <laughs> what is this gibberish? Who the hell is this? Gaia's Rage? Sonic Boom? What the fuck is going on? How do I hit this idiot? What the fuck? So I gotta reflect it back? Your work is done. What the hell? Oh, big deeps. What the hell? You power leveling piece of uh <laughs> You avoided his nuke attack? Oh no, second phase? Oh no! You're like so over leveled? Dude, that's not my fault, it's the game's fault for never ending. What happened to the old the old elder? What happened to him? Forty two damage. He's dark Gaia. What? That doesn't make any sense. This is him. I've shown he I know too much and now he has to fight me?
What the fuck? How am I supposed to avoid this? Oh, I finally hit him. Oh yeah, there's a block in this game! Holy shit! There's been such little gameplay that I completely forgot about that. Holy fuck! Fighting a Pokemon? I'm fighting against like the creator of Earth here. So we know his hands have a hitbox, how else do I hit this idiot? Maybe I gotta uh, shoot those sparks back too. That's fucking cheap. That's bullshit! Yeah, this could make or break a speedrun, exactly. Finally! Four damage? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I only got three of these left. Whoa! Go to the spot where he lowers. Alright. The spell is BS. Why am I doing no damage? Guess you're not over level. You're under level. Yeah, the first form we deleted in like three seconds. Can we use spells? We got a crit for 10 damage. I 
How the heals, man? I'm frozen! I'm fucking bread! You sure this key doesn't have a specific weakness? Are you sure I can't use spells? I should, I mean, I, I decimated the first form. Double checking. Hero Pike, yeah. And I'm level 30. Oh no. 30 is the low end? That's fucking insanity, dude. We were just talking about how over leveled I am and How do I know if these attacks are gonna, like, converge? Or is it random? Darren G. I'm out of heals. This is it. I gotta use the pin or I'm dead. Which one's the heal uh, pin? Is it the water one? Oh, rip. Can't use spells. If he does that big attack, it's GG's. Holy shit. Oh, it's Rip. Sick, bruh. Well, at least I know how the boss works now.
That was whack. Did I pop the sands before this? I did. Let me see my total heals. Nine, seven, nine. Okay, I'm gonna quit the small heal first. We know we can't use spells now. And I know now to, to drag him down by staying at the bottom. You said he had 900 health? I think that's doable. As long as I dodge a lot of the attacks. Fuck. Oh, good deeps. Good deeps. Good deeps. How much was that? That was like over 50 damage. I did at least 100 damage already, didn't I? Bullshit! I hate how it eats. It makes me face away from him. No way! That's fucking stupid! What, what is this R RNG, man? Fuck. I got four health. So dumb it makes you face the other way. I guess logically I want to stand out of the center so I don't get hit by the whole beam. Fuck. That beam is really hard to, to dodge. We should be able to do it, it's just time consuming.
Good deeps. And good RNG is not doing the stupid beam. What the fuck? It won't let me guard, man. When you do the run slide, you can't guard that entire time. How much damage do you guys think I did by now? Definitely over 200. Damn it. No, you f Oh my god, dude, it's so tilting. It's so fucking annoying. You just- there's no point of running. Like, just don't run. So you're checkmated if- So fucking stupid. Yeah, I guess eating during the menu is a good idea, Qual. I mean, you do get iframes when you eat, but it does more more harm than good. It's just, especially when I'm using the small heal claw, it's like so fucking time consuming. But I guess I'll be losing more time if I keep dying. That laser is too fast. the large heals already? Holy shit, I don't know if I can do this. I don't know what they were thinking with this boss, man. Rut red armor. The one that Claude told me to buy? No. No. Fuck. I mean, we can go buy it. I did save right before the boss. I just hate, like, if I'm in the middle of attacking the boss, I can't avoid the attack if I get bad RNG. And if I stop attacking, it's gonna take 10 years. Did it? Oh, thank God. <sighs> oh. Worst boss ever. What? I'm so lost in the story now, I have completely no idea what's going on. Why would Dark Gaia even want us to restore the Earth in the first place? Oh, 
What the hell? Oh my god, the whole village was copied? Well, if he needed us, then why did he try killing us? I'm so confused. I was a loose end. Oh no. Oh no, by the king. Oh no, it's Yomi. Razor. <laughs> I hate Yomi. This character's trash. Yeah, what the hell is Yomi? What the hell? Going where? Back to sleep. Oh my god, more voices. Oh no, light guy. Uh... 
So I'm the dark arc because the dark guy is the one that revived me. Sorta and yes. Final happy time. I thought Ellie's dead. Kelly also the same thing. Game is so dark. <laughs> oh, dude, that plot was so ridiculous. This game has like four, five plus storylines intertwined. Yeah, she was a psycho. Man, Ark had a shitty deal, dude. Oh my god. There's so much I want to say about this game. 
First off, I guess I should start with, this is probably the worst game you could possibly stream. This is the most anti-streaming game I've probably ever played. <laughs> this game was a, literally a village simulator. This game is as quintet as it gets. It's very quintet. The, their entire thing of building worlds from Actraiser and Soul Blazer and all that is definitely coming into play here. The storyline was crazy and the game was very ambitious for what I was trying to do, especially since it takes place on Earth. And the entire world is... And they show off history and... But the lowest points of this game was definitely the gameplay itself. You know, the dungeons were just... They were just there. You know, that wasn't actually what the game was. Like, the combat and the and the dungeons wasn't actually, like, a big part of the game at all. It was just fluff to get you to play a sim. Just like Actraiser was. Actraiser was, it was a low-key sim game. You know what I mean? That had these small combat parts to fool you into playing. And that's what this game is, too. Like, the, 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 the quest rewards were terrible. Like, the whole Magirock Rock thing was useless. And even, even if you did want to use the magic, on the most important parts, like, you couldn't even use magic. Except for that Bloody Mary boss. But on the last boss, you couldn't even use magic in the first place. So, like, this, the quest rewards were just not valuable at all. The traveling system was also very frustrating in this game. Like, you don't get the, the best traveling thing until the very end, and you still gotta build the strips. You know? So it's just such a pain in the ass to travel everywhere. The amount of dialogue and text in this game is insane. No wonder they didn't port this to the US. I can't imagine how much money it costs them to translate this whole game. This is like the most amount of dialogue on any game on the Super Nintendo. It's insane how much dialogue there is in this game. And mistranslated, yeah. Like, they had to build multiple villages, have multiple multiple line of text, and they even had to change the map. The, like, this game is so huge. Like, it's crazy. I just feel like a lot of people will get just turned off by the gameplay and they won't see it to its completion. Like, playing this blind without a guide would probably be the most frustrating thing ever. It's so frustrating. It would have been so frustrating. I feel like if they would have put more of their work into actual gameplay, and the dungeons, and the bosses, and the combat, and the rewards, like how, like even the inventory system was weird in this game, you know? Just the way you have to use items that is so clunky and strange. And there's so many like big characters that don't really you don't really feel like the impact of them because they just go like epic things happen so fast to the characters like Roy for example it's like you killed my best friend like they just like shoehorn that in you know but the big bottom line of the story is good but yeah man I got so lost like this will be a pretty memorable game that's for sure there's not really nothing like this so was this Quintet's last game before they went under? <laughs> like, Jesus. It's been a nightmare translating this game. Yeah, they went under after this. I can totally see why. There's a lot of good RPGs on the Super Nintendo. A lot of good ones. And this one is... This one flew too close to the sun. They couldn't release it before the end came for them. Interesting. So, was it Kino? Which of the three was the best one? I really like Soul Blazer and I really like Illusions of Gaia. 
Probably Gaia, though, is probably the best one. Probably. Soul Blazer was pretty linear, so probably Gaia. Soul Blazer also had a really weird combat system with the orb circling you. That was very odd. You don't like linear play this game? <laughs> the, <laughs> the problem is, is that this one has the least amount of gameplay out of the three games claw. So, yeah, it's not linear at all, but then you get zero gameplay. I can't believe I was under level. That also blows my mind away. Like, what the hell was that about? Yeah, man, that's crazy. I can't believe I streamed this game, but this is the end of 95. You know, we still have like 25, maybe 30 games left in the list to play on the stream itself. But with Street of Fighter 6 around the corner, this is it, boys. No Limit Retro begins. Good game, godlike games from here. What's so good about the red armor? Because it crits so often? It gives 15 strength. It's like a glass cannon armor. Who could that be? Who is it? Is anyone going to explain the damn story to me yet? What? Oh my god. Inception? Ugh. There's two theories. It was either the bird, <laughs> which was Dark Ark Reborn, yeah, because of his dream, or Light Ark himself. Well, either way, that, that sucks ass for Ark. He's a bird, so that's whack. And Light Ark is not even him, so that's even more whack. It's like, uh, it's like, you saved the world, you're the hero. By the way, your twin stole your lady. The end. Oh my god. So what the hell was the story of this game? Being a god? 1 a.m. My goodness. Almost eight hours we had to stream to finish this shit. Ugh. That game took way too long to beat. An unreasonable amount of time. And that was with a full-on, like, guide. That's crazy. That was Quintet's Magnum Opus. It put them out of business, Claw. Oh, my God. Well, anyways, Jaeger, thanks so much, man, for guiding me throughout the game, dude. I literally would have flushed it if it wasn't for you. I would have flushed this fucking game in a heartbeat. But we did it. We finished the Quintet Trilogy. I can say I did. It was an experience. That's for damn sure. It was an experience.